One second, everybody. <clears throat> All right, let me get it shared out and we can officially begin today's session. Bring it up in that with our gameplay. <clears throat> And then go from there. All right, let me get it shared out. Put it in Discord, and we are good to go. There we go. Sir Chester saying first, that you are, brother. And Ryan saying second, that you are, my man. Uh, how you doing today, Sir Chester? And Sir Ryan. Oh, goodness. Sir Chester and Ryan with the like. Thank you, guys. Ah, oh, goodness. So let me go. Okay, so we're looking for our Cinderace raid, which I think I have to connect online. So one second. Um, I'm trying to remember. It's been a minute. I'm a little frazzled right now. Danielle says third aid, Danielle. Alright, uh, mystery gifts. Check hope for moves. Danielle with the double like. Thank you, Danielle. Uh, Sir Tess says, and last day at work, then on vacation next week. Ooh, very nice, bro. Very, very nice. Any plans on your vacation? Alright, so we check the poke portal news. I think. Let me let me double do it just in case. <laughs> Sir Chester says, Danielle, so you basically lost to me twice. Ah, uh, it happens. It happens. Either way though. Today, uh we're gonna do some Cinderace raids. Uh some different raids as well, because we need some Herba Mystica. And also uh, do some shiny hunting for maybe Roaring Moon today, hopefully. Okay, so let's see where our Cinderace raid is for the day. Uh, ooh, got a ghastly outbreak. Gyarados outbreak, too. That's not too bad. Uh, we have Richard with the like as well. Thank you, Richard. How are you doing today, dude? There he is. Oh, he's near my favorite town. It's, it's at Paddywhack Town. Danielle with the uh, closed mouth emote or emoji. I always say emote because of games now, but it's emoji. But alright. Go over here to get this one officially started. We'll save in front of the two in case like somebody needs him. Uh, for today, we'll do him a couple of times. Let's see. Oh, yes, I have Slowbro in the front. Uh, there it is. So let's go ahead and save, and go from there. Okay, so we're saved. Connect to the internet, which I think that does save as well. Every time you connect to the internet. Yep, it does. Uh, so Chess says, no real plans, but definitely try to get some more streams and at least some more TikTok ones too. Very nice, bro. Very nice. You know for a fact I don't use the Tiki Tac Patty Whack. However, I've heard that uh, that the first one that you did, uh, according to what I uh, heard from your last stream that you did and uh, from Danielle, that it went really, really well. You had a lot of people uh, viewing, which is great, my man. But all right, so let's go ahead and get this one up and ready to go. Of course, we already get a communication error. It wouldn't be a Pokemon stream if there wasn't at least a few errors. Alright, it is up. 
We got this. Oh, goodness. Uh, I would have gone a couple hours earlier, but I, uh, I had, uh, uh, had some errands I had to run. Daniel says, I did a TikTok one yesterday, not too shabby. Nice, Daniel. Very nice. Uh, so Chester says, I average well over 100 people and a lot of new followers and Discord people, so definitely helping with growth for, for now. I'm glad it's helping with growth, without a doubt, my man. Like I said, I just don't do TikTok. TikTok has never been my thing. We got Danielle in. Welcome back, Danielle. Hey, what's up, Simon? Simon says, hello, Blake. How are you doing today, Simon? I had to go run some errands. I did uh, end up getting, they finally had at my local Walmart, which I have not seen these packs uh, yet. They finally had some Silver Tempest packs, so I grabbed two of them. And uh, might open them later. Still no um, uh, Lost Origin packs, surprisingly. Sir Chester says, you could also help help with the growth of something. Eh, name the time and the place, and I'll help grow that all day and night. Uh, but I hope everybody's doing good today. And then, of course, tomorrow we will not be doing raids. or We will be shiny hunting, but we will primarily be giving out shiny Pokemon because tomorrow is our shiny Sunday. Which I can't believe it's already Sunday. Oh, uh, good. Alright, so we'll wait till it gets 45 seconds. Like, we just started to. Wait, we're not even five minutes in yet, so it's going to take a second before we get uh, some more people in to do these raids. But either way, we're going to have fun with it today, guys. Oh, goodness. Go back in a minute, see if it'll actually... I'm trying to see if, like, it'll show up for, like, when I have to check, um, different reactions, like the hearts and everything like that. Oh, God, I didn't even notice our time was almost up. But yesterday, it, it, for some reason, like, it was just not showing up at all, which was kind of a pain, but I think I got everybody's out, uh, reactions yesterday, which is good. So Chess says, I also brought my Switch to work today, too. Ooh, nice, bro. Very, very nice. Uh, see, like, if I were to have a job like you and, uh, Danielle, like, I would definitely have to bring something to keep me entertained, or at least, like, headphones to listen to music or something like that. But yeah, we'll go for, like, uh, we'll do a regular three-hour session today, and then after, uh, after the session today, I have to go and get the rest of the Pokemon for uh, tomorrow's event. I meant almost, not also. Oh, okay, my bad. My oh, wait, you did put that. You did put that. I read it as all also. My bad, dude. That is my fault. Uh, I would start bringing it, because you never know. Some days could go a little slow, and you might have a little bit of uh, free time to be able to play. Alright, so we got our two iron defenses, so now I have to use, uh, we got Bearded Vet with the like. What's up, Bearded Vet? How are you doing today, dude? Hello, Bearded Vet says hello. How are you doing, my man? My man, not my man. I did, I did also at first and deleted the comment. Oh, okay, okay. That's why I like when I look back at it. Okay, so that's my bad. Uh, Sir Chess says I was going to, but thought I would uh would have to float a different building today, so I didn't do it. Ah, uh, fair. That is fair, my man. Uh, but you did. I I do remember you did get your uh, Cinder Race. I believe it was the second to last one that you did. Um, because last one you did, I believe, was a shiny giveaway, and I was just screwing with you in chat, having a good time, and uh. Yeah, because it was you, me, Mitchell, and then somebody else. I don't, I don't remember who, but it was other members of your community. I was just there chatting, having fun, like always. Yay! Cinderace is paralyzed. It needs a wheelchair. Okay.
All right, so if the game will let me battle... Uh, okay, so I have my three, so now I can hit him, and he probably will be dead in one hit. No? I did my three, right? Or is my math off? Uh, Sir Chess says, yeah, I got him. Jamie and I have a date night tonight, so I might, uh, try to host some, uh, tomorrow, maybe. Very nice, bro. Why don't you ever take me on date night? I want to go places. I want to get dolled up. <laughs> Sir Chess just says, great, now you pissed him off. Dude, I don't know what happened there. Like... It might be because, like, we did have some people, too, also lowering his, um, lowering his defenses as well, so that's, that's possibility of why we didn't one-shot him right there. But either way, we got this. I believe in us. Alright, so let's use another stored power. Ooh, that did some damage, but either way, he hasn't... He hasn't nullified our effects yet, so that's actually really good. Because as soon as he does that, like, it is over. As soon as I open my mouth. As soon as I open my mouth. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do it now. Nope, he's going to one-shot me. He's probably going to one-shot me the, uh, next time I come around because all the bolts he's done as well. Uh, every time I say something, like, it always happens. Every single time. I'm cursed, chat. Alright, so let's see if we can get... That did some damage. So if we can get two and two, then I... Th without dying, then I think we have a good chance. Which is gonna be kind of a pain. So we got one. Let's see if we can get two. I don't even know what our HP is at right now. It's at half. It's at half. Okay, so that plus the leftover should put us back to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Jess says, you say, man, I wish a million dollars would drop in my house to see if it works. No, it's only the cursed stuff that works. Like, yesterday was um saying, like, I really hope we don't run into uh, this shiny Pokemon. And unfortunately... As soon as I said it, like, he showed up, and I was like, I don't need you right now. Daniel says, we got this, Blake, so close. Yeah, I believe in us. I believe in Okay, so, I have two HP. Uh, but I have my, I have all my stuff up, so if he doesn't hit, I can do a cheer, heal up, and then hit. And then he should be dead. I, I did see some people, uh, actually manage to defeat him first go, like, solo, and I was like, that is really impressive. Okay. So, yeah, I'm... This is gonna be super, super risky. But I'm going to try to hit him with stored power and go from there. Oh, his shield broke. Nice. Oh, very nice. Daniel healed me. So, yeah, if I can hit him with sword power before the battle ends, it's over. I think we win. Yep, we did it. GG's, Daniel. That one was super close. Like, holy crap. What's my phone going off for? Ow. Oh. It was to let me know that uh, I shared it <laughs> for some reason. Okay. Thank you, phone. That in Pokemon Go. Simon says, GG's. Much love to you, Simon. Daniel says, whoop. Dude, that was super easy. Like, I am surprised we got that one. Hell yes. Ah. Uh. Alright, since we don't have that many people in right now, too, I'm gonna go find uh, some different raids to do. Let's see. We'll check out this one first. This will be our first check. Cause I know too, if like uh, during tomorrow's event, if people um, if people need him, like the community will in fact help out. And plus, if we have enough time, we might be able to do at least one one or two of them. 
Plus, we did we did him quite a lot yesterday. I want to say like six six times, if I'm not mistaken. Six plus. There we go. Altaria, dark type. Uh, let me go ahead. And I'm going to switch to big boy, and then go from there. All right, so there we go. Five star. Because, unfortunately, I do need some Urban Mystica. I really, really need some Urban Mystica, because we are running really, really low on it. Unfortunately. Okay, let me check something. Make sure I didn't miss any sort of reactions. No, we are good. We are good and set. All right, sweet. The code is up. Let's do this, guys. See if I can't have the stream up. There we go. There we go. For later on purposes. There we go. All right, sweet. Because uh, like I said, we're running a little bit low. Honor of a Mystica. We keep finding shinies. Don't get me wrong. The problem is they're shinies that I don't personally need right now because of the fact that we already have caught them or have them in, like, previous games. Like, right now we have uh, the entire Palmy line ready to evolve, so we have, like, a full line of them shiny. And uh, yesterday, oh, goodness, we ended up with, like, I want to say five shiny Pokemon, both uh, Zoelius and Gibble, but... Again, we did not need them. Uh, I remember, too, like, uh, towards the end of the session, um, we got Simon in. Welcome, Simon, to your first one of the day. And don't forget, Simon, belly boy, got, belly boy, got boys. Be belly drum boys, that's what it was. Belly drum boys. Uh... But yeah, we were, uh, towards the end of the stream, we were talking a lot about Final Fantasy and, uh, Kingdom Hearts yesterday, and it was so, it was a good, good topic to talk about, because I like, I really, really like the Kingdom Hearts, and, or, fa Final Fantasy mainly, but Kingdom Hearts is also really, really good. We were talking about that, just having a good time with it and chilling. Simon says, we got this, oh yeah, without a doubt, my man, without a doubt. Remember, belly drum boys. Alright, so we hit 45. So let's go ahead and start this raid. Because I think I have enough for, I want to say five sandwiches now at this point. Uh, I'll have to check, but really, really need some Urban Mystica to continue uh, shiny hunting with the, with the uh, sandwich method. Let's see. I do have Swab... Come to think about it, I did find a random shiny Swab Blue one day while... Uh, going for raids. I think it was the same day we got Skiddo. We got both Skiddo and uh, uh, Swablu. I was trying to remember its name already. But it was a lot of fun. Daniel says, damn, I was joining. Sorry, Daniel. It, I was wondering like if you were joining or not. It just hit the 45 second left, but we'll get you in the next one. Ah, uh, it's an auto sleep, but that's alright. I can wake myself up. Alright, so I'll go ahead and heal us up to uh, get everybody up and ready to go. Oh, very, very nice, Simon. Simon almost one-shot him right there. Alright, so I needed that in order. I needed to do the heal just so I could wake the hell up, my character. Uh, kind of thing with you. Uh, I was thinking, like, uh, because I haven't opened up Silver Tempest yet, so this will be my first PAX opening it. Um, Daniel says I was taking meds for headache. You're good, Daniel. You are good. Hey, Shield Bro. You know for a fact we will get a lot more of these up. Simon says, what the heck? Oh, yeah, so Byron let us know that uh, right now, Play Rough, like... Uh, shows it doing more damage than what it actually does, so it's not them getting health back. It's, uh, the game trying to correct itself onto, like, how much damage was actually done. But either way, he is gonna be dead. Did I not belly drum? I could've sworn I belly drum, but I don't know why. Or no, his shield's probably still up. The game probably hasn't recognized it yet. 
But I was gonna say, uh, I was watching last night, uh, when I woke up, uh, some, uh, Silver Tempos pack openings, and there's some really nice cards in that set. Like, I know Lost Origin is, uh, probably better in terms of, like, what you can, uh, pull, like, a character cards and things like that. Unfortunately, my Walmart did not have those, so... I, I want to get them because there is a uh, Charizard with Leon character card that it's not too expensive to just buy, but I like pulling my stuff the majority of the time. Daniel says, you guys got this. Like I said, Daniel, we'll get you in the next one. Because we this one's definitely beat. It's just being kind of a pain. I don't think I have my belly drum effect. Either that or... Um, it's because, um, oh, there we go, Simon killed him. Or at least I think he did. Oh, okay, no, it was the shield. It was the shield. Alright, so, let's see if he's actually dead or not. Okay, no. Like I said, it's glitched right now with Play Rough. Because Play Rough on screen, like, does more, uh, damage than what it actually does. Simon says, GG's. GG's to you, bro. GG's to you. Like I said, I guess I didn't get my belly drum off. Like, I guess he hit me before I was able to uh, do it. So that was all Simon right there. Alright, so we don't need to catch him because, for one thing, we already have him. And for two, he's not shiny. No Herba Mystica from that one, unfortunate. But we will get it. Hopefully today. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully today. Because like I said, I got enough for, I believe, five sandwiches left. And after, like, I'm trying to get Roaring Moon right now. And then later on, Slitherwing. Okay, so let's go check this bug one. Also, uh, just because of the fact I use him more, we're going to change. We got Peyton with the like. What's up, Peyton? How are you doing today, dude? Uh, Daniel says, I'm in a Tatsugiri raid. I think he might maybe shiny hard as Catchman find out. Because he does have three shinies, so that makes it a little bit hard. The only one I can honestly remember is the white one. Simon says, Urba's really hard to find. Yeah, I feel, for some reason, I was talking about this earlier. I feel like since the Cinderace event came out at the beginning of the month, that it hasn't been giving it to us as much lately, which which is very, very unfortunate. I know some people are using a... Uh, some people told me that they use a um, sandwich to make it so you get better items for raids, which is not bad, but I don't know what the ingredients are for the sandwich, unfortunately. So I'm not sure if they, like, change the percentage... For them or what? Because that does sound like something Game Freak would do. Would silently put that in with uh, Cinder Race. Because I think the last one we got was probably One Piece. Daniel says, "Okay, nope, not shiny." See, that was another thing too. I remember um, Danielle here actually got into a shiny raid. It wasn't hers. It was a random one. It was a Vaporeon, and uh, she. Her and a couple other members of chat told me, like, uh, that unfortunately it doesn't do any kind of sparkle while in the raid, so you really have to pay attention to them, which, for Pokemon that, like, you can't really tell if they're shiny or not, is a super big bummer, unfortunately. Like, some of those ones where, like, it's so hard to tell, like, I just will have to, uh, be able to do that. Daniel says, teammates don't know uh, their typings and kept dying. Yeah, Daniel was saying, like, uh, <laughs> they kept dying. Oh, what what level was that raid, anyways? I'm imagining five or six star. Because I've seen Vaporeon and uh, both of those. But, yeah, like, and unfortunately, since it was a random one, like, there was no guarantee, like, she could get back in it to defeat it, unfortunately. Uh... Also, uh, I did see something kind of cool in Walmart. I didn't pick one up yet, but I probably will next time. Um, they have the, uh, ooh, 
I didn't mean to run into you. They have the uh, new starter Pokemon boxes out, which look, they look really, really cool. Uh, I didn't grab one today, but I'll probably grab one later on. And uh, they they look nice. And also, they uh, the big promo card thing was a Maridon GX, which I was... GX or EX? I can't remember which. We haven't had GX cards in so long, so that like brought a little bit of nostalgia back for me. It was like seeing those type of... Uh, Cards be brought back to the table. Daniel says six star. Okay, I figured it was. I figured it was five or six. There, I just was not too sure which one. But those new boxes, they look. They look pretty good. Like, uh, I know. Like when it comes to the new cards too. Um, for people who um, collect Pokemon cards, they'll know. Like, uh, for English sets, like the border is yellow. They're changing it to white, which throws a lot of people off. And uh, when I heard about that, I'm like, oh, so it's just like a Japanese, most Japanese sets that have a yellow, silverish border around to them. Sue says, yeah. Okay, so it's EX. Okay, my bad. Nice, Sue. How are you doing today, dude? But I thought it was really cool, so I'm wondering, like, are they going to bring tho those back for uh, when we get base set uh, Scarlet and Violet uh, packs to come out? Oh man, we are just not getting any five star raids right now, and I'm I keep running into small things because <laughs> like they did bring uh I will say they did bring some EX cards back um when it came to the celebration set, which were uh that was really really cool to see them again, uh. But, like, I figured, like, since we have, like, V, V-Star, and everything, like, uh, we probably would never get them back, uh, as an, like, full official release. But seeing that, and also seeing them in celebrations was really, really nice. Sue says, good, how are your day? Ah, uh, it's going, it's going. Had to go run some errands, so that's why, uh, we're a little bit late for today's. Otherwise, I would have been live, like, hours ago. We would have probably been done with today's session. To Dene, no to him. But other than that, I am doing all right. I guess uh, I was looking up Silver Tempest too. Like I was looking to see what the um, best card to pull was. I, I wanted to make sure, but I I kind of already knew it. It's the uh, Lugia alt art, which looks really really awesome. And uh, I believe like. Raw, fresh, out of a pack, that card goes for, like, 220 bucks, depending on, like, uh, if it's a, like, good centering without being graded or anything along those lines. And while looking at uh, another one, like, uh, Cosmic Eclipse, I didn't know this. Uh, I actually did pull the rarest trainer card out of it, uh, which now can, like, graded at a 9, I believe, goes for, like, 400 bucks. I traded that card to my brother though for some fossil uh for some fossil uh hollows because at the time it was like forty to fifty dollar card uh not graded and I was like yeah sure plus he liked the trainer he likes the trainer cards better than me so I traded it to him when I saw the price I was like I should have waited <laughs> but for me too like I liked I like the cards I got better from the trade than um uh, than the card I pulled which if I remember correctly the centering on it was really really good for it so i don't know if he i think that's one that he also wants to send in to get graded because like he has a pile of uh cards that he has put away to go get graded and so do i hey what's up tito tito says what up uh omega sparta and everyone in chat how are you doing today my man all right so let's go we're still looking for a five star raid uh we've already done our cinderace and we did him plenty of times yesterday, so I figured why not go ahead and do some other ones, because we need some Herba Mystica. But unfortunately, the game right now is just not giving any 5-star to us that are not part of the uh, Cinderace thing, because those are already fixed to where you don't get any uh, Herba Mystica. 3-star. Okay, uh, we check those... We haven't checked these two yet, so we'll go check these two real quick. Like I said, we'll be doing some raids. 
today, and then I'll be switching over towards the end of the stream to see if we can't get our shiny growing moon. And then after stream, uh, I have to go and get the rest of the Pokemon for Shiny Sunday. There we go. Five star. It's weird seeing him as a dragon type. But alright. Code is up, chat. Oh, goodness. I gotta sneeze. Uh, make sure to see if there's any reactions that I, again, missed. I did. For some reason, it didn't pop up. We got Tito with the like as well. Thank you, Tito. For some reason, that one did not come up. Weird. Maybe it's late. Maybe it's late. We got Simon back in. Welcome back, Simon. Really, really hope my activity feed for um for this one does not mess up. Because, like, like I said, if this one messes up, then it's going to be a little bit annoying to be able to thank you guys for your likes and shares and all of that. All right. This is, I kind of think, but this was actually one of my favorite Pokemon from last generation. Like, uh, I was really glad to get him early. Uh, in fact, like, uh, most of the Pokemon that I wanted for my team last generation for story base wise and Sword and Shield, I got them very, very early, and I was noticing, like, a pattern with that. We got Sue in. Welcome, Sue, to your first one of the day. And we got room for one more person. Yeah, I don't know why. But Tito's did not pop up. Not only that, but my activity feed on OBS just still is not working. I got to figure out what is going on with it. Because like I said, if this one goes out, then uh, unfortunately we got some issues. We got Danielle in as well. Sweet. So we have a full team for this one. And we have also officially been live for half an hour. Let's see. I'm trying to see if... Uh... Hmm. Like I said, I don't know why Tito's did not appear on stream, but I'll figure it out later. Either way, thank you, Tito. Sue says, my bad. Uh, my, my bad. My kids start crying. No, you're good, Sue. You are good, dude. All right. So now we can play rough them. Ooh, that was almost a full kill right there. Very, very nice. Alright, so we definitely, definitely got this one. <coughs> And my Pokemon has become weaker to fire. Damn, Diamonds is definitely way tougher than mine, without a doubt. Alright, so we got rid of our Belly Drum, unfortunately. But I think I'm still in the green so I can get it back. Alright, so yeah, we can get it back. We can get it back. We are good. Alright. Ooh. 
that did some damage, but that's alright. We already used our belly drum, so we should be able to get rid of the shield. Okay, so it shows a shield gone, but it's possibly not gone? I really don't know. I just want to know what happened to our reactions right there. Simon says minus hyper drink. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, very nice, bro. Very, very nice. Yeah, still, the game still doesn't recognize that his uh, shield is dead, unfortunately. Luckily, he doesn't do that much damage to us, unless it's that, uh... Unless... Oh, he killed me, though. I forgot about both Sandstorm and uh, Burn. That's okay, though. Oh, uh, we might have ran out of time for this one. I believe we did. If we did, that's alright. Yep, we did. That's okay, though, because we'll get it back up. We will get it back up, chat. All right. Uh, I do want to check. So I'm gonna close what I have for my uh, notifications. Pull it back up and then see if it's still working. Cause like I said, I just want to make sure that everything is working correctly. So I'm gonna replay one. There we go. Hmm. I don't know why it didn't show up, but either way, it's all good. So let's go ahead and get the code back up for this one. And just kind of go from there. Like I said, I'd make sure that, uh, want to make sure that it is working correctly. I just don't know why it didn't show Tito's for some reason. Either way, it's all good. We'll figure it out. Oh, goodness. Where's my drink? Ah, there it is. Great. I'm, used, I'm so used to drinking a Coke on stream. We got Sue back in. Welcome back, Sue. <clears throat> and we got room for two more chat. We got Simon back in. Welcome back, Simon. And we got room for one more person. Uh, Sue says, "Why well, I feel like the, why well, I feel like the shield go, the shield go with more, wait, why well, I feel like the shield go with Pokemon, oh, <clears throat> why do I feel like the shield give the Pokemon more hell? It does, uh, it makes it so, like, their defenses are raised more. Like, that's the purpose of the shield. And we got Danielle back in. Welcome back, Danielle. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and ready up. So yeah, it definitely does that. It makes it so like uh, they take a little, they take less damage, uh, basically, with the shield up. Uh, but like I said, uh, <clears throat> apparently Play Rough is, uh, uh, Daniel says, who's, as who's ever Esmeralda has huge power ability. It's bugged, that's why he gets more health. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. Mine has a zip zap. Or zap sap zipper. Zap zipper. I will say zip zap. I don't know why. But either way, it's all good. We got this. I believe in us. Simon says my okay, so it's Simon's that has that. Either way, it's all good. Win or lose, as long as we have fun. Two out of four for shinies. I remember yesterday too when we were doing um, 
when we were doing Cinderace, like, we had a couple of times where, like, everybody had a shiny Pokemon. It was really, really cool to see, like, all four Pokemon on screen shiny at the same time. Alright, so let's use Play Rub. We got Mitchell with the like. Okay, so now it's working now. We got Mitchell with the like. What's up, Mitchell? Mitchell says, afternoon. How are you doing today, Mitchell? Hey, what's up, MJ? MJ says, hey, hey, what are we doing? We're doing uh, some raids right now, uh, MJ, in hopes of getting some Herba Mystica. And how are you doing today? And like I said, uh, earlier in today's session, uh, we're going to go for three hours today, and then as soon as I end the stream, I'm going to uh, go and get the rest of the Pokemon for today's session. Uh, we also had Sue with the like. Thank you, Sue. Mitchell says, pretty sure it's... Like, Shut up, Mitchell. And for some reason, Byron posts a bacon emoji. What's up, Byron? MJ says, I'm good. How are you? I'm doing all right. Had a, uh, we would have been live earlier, but had to go run some errands really quick. Uh, came back, but I did get a couple of packs of uh, some Silver Tempest, which I haven't opened yet. So, looking forward to opening those later today. Uh, Mitchell says, Danielle, are you going to stream multiplayer? I don't know what she's doing today. She's also sick today. And Byron with the snake. That snake can go straight to hell, Byron. <laughs> Oh, goodness. <laughs> Why is he so high up in the air? He's just, I just now realize he's kind of flying. Uh, MJ says, I got a Steinle, uh, shiny uh, Stantler and uh, Cool Launcher, or however you spell it. Very nice, MJ. Very, very nice. As you saw during yesterday's session, I, I mentioned it earlier, we ended up getting uh, five shinies, which was uh, both Gibble and Zuelius, which we did not need. Danielle says later on, yeah. Ah, oh, I wish, I really, really wish he would die already. Ah, uh, because we need to beat him. Mitchell says, it's that, like, s small thing. Shut up, Mitchell. Uh, Mitchell says, my, my fire mine up as well. Like I said, I don't have that game. Alright, he's probably close to being dead. Okay, Shield Throat says uh, final health's gonna show, possibly. I don't know why it's, uh... Uh... Daniel says, oh, when we trade mons for tomorrow, I could try out my new mic for call. Alright, what kind of mic did you get, <clears throat> Daniel? MJ says, I need some herbs. We'll come on and do these raids with us, MJ. I don't know why he's so high in the air right now. That is... That is no. That is some BS. He was dead, but then he had like a little pinch left. Are you kidding me? <clears throat> she says he hit me. He hit me twice. Sometimes he does. Sometimes they do that where they get two moves to be able to use that. Oh my goodness, that's a little frustrating. It's all good though. Okay, so gathered up. Let's see. Then you'll send me a picture. Okay. Wait, where did you get that from? I've never seen anything like that. Sent you a pic. Yeah, yeah I, I saw it. Never seen one like that before. MJ says I'll wait till next one. Alright, no worries, MJ. No worries. If we don't beat him this time, then you guys know how I do it. I go and find us a different one to do. Uh I'm gonna check reactions really quick. 
we got Byron with the heart. Much love to you, Byron. <clears throat> All right, so we got Simon back in as well. Welcome back, Simon. I feel like some of my notifications aren't coming through, unfortunately. I don't know. I know for a fact Tito's didn't show up, and that that's really weird because I'm even looking at OBS and like it just didn't. Or not OBS, but Steam Labs. I'm using that for uh, notifications, and uh, just for some reason that one did not pop up. Uh, Sue says one the other. Sh Shiny Sandy shot. We found. Uh, we got him. Uh, Sue. So we got. We caught him the other day. Thankfully. Uh, Mitchell says, Daniel, should I fire up my stream for COD with you? I'll stay on COD. I'll at least be on call with you two while you do it. We got Daniel back in. Welcome back, Daniel. And we got room for one more person. And Daniel says, Hell yeah. Like I said, I'll stay on call with you guys. But all right, we hit the forty. Uh, we hit the timer, so let's go ahead and ready up for this raid. Weird thing is, it doesn't show Simon like uh check mark, but I'm pretty sure he is because it gives me the option to start the raid. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait just to be sure, because I've I've seen we've had this glitch before, unfortunately, and again like it, I can't tell, <laughs> so I just want to make sure that he is good for it. So there we go. Simon says, yep, I have. See, okay. I figured you did, Simon. I just I want to make sure before I read it up, just in case, like, if it was going to kick you out or anything like that. Because, like I said, we've gotten that glitch before. Uh, Mitchell says, you guys can make fun of me not being able to snipe uh, still standing players, but get all the tricky moving targets. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead, do our belly drum. All right, that did some damage, but that's all right. And we'll start play rope again. Ooh, giga hammer. Daniel with the laughing emojis to what Mitchell said. Goodness gracious, Simon almost killed him right there. Alright, he got rid of his negative effects, but we still have our belly drum. Thankfully. His flame body did that, but that's alright because we do have our um, our shell bell, so we will get help. It feels like they nerfed shell bell too. Like it feels like we don't get as much from shell bell anymore. Because I remember once uh one stream when we were raiding, I had noticed like we literally got two HP back. Okay, so we missed that, but that's okay because we don't have uh, we don't have our play rough ability. So I'm gonna heal us up to get rid of the burn effect, and to do that, we got Martin with the like and the share. What's up, Martin? Oh, wrong thing. <laughs> uh, Simon says my shiny little beast, dude. He's tough. He is tough. I will give you that, my man. Martin says, "Let's fucking go, buddy. How are you doing today, Martin?" Martin says, hope you're well. Doing all right, man. Doing all right. I had to run some errands earlier. Uh, that's why we're a little bit late for today's session, but we'll be going for three hours today. And then after, go get the rest of the Pokemon and just kind of go from there.
<laughs> Martin says, and everyone in chat as well, too. <laughs> Much love to you, Martin. Yeah, our game's glitch. <laughs> Look, like, to where his health is, that's the shield point, that little uh, marker right there. And, yeah, it just, the game can't keep up sometimes, I swear. Oh, goodness. Like I said, if we fail this one, though, we'll go find a different one so we're not stuck on it all day. And, unfortunately, I died right there. That's all right. That was my first hit. We still got some time. All right. His shield broke, so... It, it broke, but it's still showing the shield icon, unfortunately. So let's go ahead and belly drum. Belly drum, and then hit him and go from there. All right. So let's go play rough him. Of course, I missed. Uh, Martin says, "Nice. I've just uh just got back home. Uh, too been out all day, so just chilling for five minutes. Very nice, bro. Very very nice. Went and uh, like I said, did some errands, but I did end up getting two packs of um Silver Tempest that I plan on opening up later. Not on stream, but just." later in general that I have actually not opened up the set yet. So I'm kind of excited to see what I get. Of course, no Herba Mystica from that one. That is alright. Tito says, I'm still here. Awesome, bro. Awesome. And Simon says, GG's. GG's to you, Simon. GG's to you, brother. Alright, so we beat that one. So, we didn't check this one. We didn't check our electric one yet. I do remember that. So, I said I was going to check this one and then the electric to see if we, uh... Oh, my game's just completely... Uh, look at that! Uh, so for those of you who can see it, look at the very top of the screen. Uh, yeah, the raid, uh... The raid health bar is still there. That's, that's wonderful. I've... I've never seen that glitch before! <laughs> Okay, game. Uh, why? I just now noticed it, but yeah, if we go like a little bit more in the sky, it's more noticeable, and it fl and it flashes too. That's that is weird. I've never seen that glitch before. Huh. Okay. Either way. Uh, there we go. Five star. Uh, I'm gonna have to switch to our slow bro. Actually, no. We'll switch to Iron Hands. Just hope I don't spoil what we have for Shiny Sunday. Yep, I was going the wrong way. There we go. I'll use my Iron Hands. <laughs> Martin says, huh, it's glitched. Dude, I've never seen that glitch before. That's a first for me. Is saying that one. All right, so I'm gonna use my iron hands for this one, but code is up, chat. <coughs> oh goodness, <laughs> that's weird. it's still up in the background. So I'm wondering after doing this raid if it'll go away. If not, I'll uh, I'll save, turn it off, turn it back on to get rid of that because that's gonna be a little bit annoying. I don't want to stare at that for hours. Oh goodness, that's just weird. Like I said, I love these games. Uh, I love the Pokemon series, but this one is definitely the most buggy one we've ever had. We got Simon back in. Welcome back, Simon. Uh, let's see what that was. Okay, it's a different Discord. All right, we are good. We got Daniel back in. Welcome back, Daniel. And we got room for one more. We got MJ in for her first raid of the day. Welcome, MJ. Also, come to think of it, I forgot. This is a Scarlet exclusive Pokemon. I just thought of that. Is Danielle going to use Jeffrey the Giraffe? There's no way she's going to use Jeffrey the Giraffe. Simon's going to be using his Nile Plague. Nile is pretty cool. Uh, Simon says, I'm trying this Pokemon. All right, sweet, bro. Sweet. 
Uh, for people who don't know what I'm talking about when I say Jeffrey the Giraffe, that is a uh, that is the mascot for Toys R Us, which apparently does still have stores. It has a few stores, like not anywhere big as what it was uh, when it went bankrupt, and they were also selling stuff online. I'm not sure where these stores are at. Uh, but I would definitely love to go into one, again, for nostalgia. Because I remember, like, back during my, uh, back during my Yu-Gi-Oh, uh, collecting era, like, that was the place I always, all ooh, Daniel has a shiny up in, very nice. Uh, back during my Yu-Gi-Oh collecting era, that's where what I, I would always get, like, the, uh, tins for them, was, uh, was in fact uh there and so like when that was like when the first set of tens came out for Yu-Gi-Oh, which was um they had six of them two kaiba themed two joey themed and two yugi themed and i went with the uh blue eyes white dragon one because blue eyes was my favorite and the only thing i was disappointed in with it was the fact that it wasn't the artwork from the anime but i eventually did get that one thankfully Mitchell says, Danielle voice chats. She might. She might, man. You never know. Danielle says, yeah, one sec. Gotta, uh, gotta out pants on. You gotta out your pants, huh? You snitching on your pants, Danielle? Like I said, I will join it after today's session. So that way we can do some trades, joke around, just kind of have a good time. And I already know how they, those two when they're in voice chat, they just make fun of me, so. Alright. Game. Hello. Put, I know what you meant, Danielle, I'm just giving you a hard time. Okay, there we go. Um, Martin says, I've only ever done four-star ones. Uh, Four star are okay, Martin. The problem is you don't get Herba Mystica from them for the shiny sandwiches. It's five star and six star, as long as they're not a part of an event. Like, for example, there are other five star ones going around for the uh, Cinderace thing. The thing is, they're always fixed. Like, you do not even get a chance to get Herba Mystica from it, unfortunately. So we just kind of go from there. Daniel says no bad Mitchell. I, I chose to ignore that comment. I chose to ignore it. Oh goodness. So let's use drain punch. I don't think I have to get any uh Speaking of which, I don't think I have to get any eggs to hatch for Shiny Sunday tomorrow, because we still have quite a few uh, to hatch from last Shiny Sunday. We got about more than we hatched, but that was okay. I wanted to go longer and hatch the entire boxes that we had ready to go. The only problem was like my hydraulics in my chair gave out, which ended up really, really messing up my back right there. All right, so we're going to have to get this one back up, but that's okay. It's shield, bro, but it doesn't matter because we are out of time. He's probably about to kill me, too. I'm surprised he did not kill me. All right, that's okay, though. We'll get it back up. It is no worries at all. Okay, that was my weather app. Um, check to make sure that I didn't miss anything. I did. We have Danielle with the heart. She switched over to a heart. Much love to you, Danielle. Uh, MJ says, I'll bring someone different. All right, no worries, MJ. No worries. Martin says, I have to get my ass into gear then. See, that's why I always do five, and that's why I don't bother with the lower level uh, raids. However, we do do the uh, Scarlet Scusa Pokemon because somebody might be on Violet, but they don't have that extra 60 bucks to uh, buy the other version of the game, which is ridiculous. Which, uh, to like get all the Pokemon, so that's why we do those. Because, like, for example, 
this one is an exclusive Pokemon, uh, but if it was like a four star, I still would have done it, uh, just for the fact that you never know. Plus, someone might have a friend who has uh, that version of the game and just give it to them right after. Uh, how far are you into the game, Martin? Come to think of it, we got Sue back in. Welcome back, Sue. Martin says, yeah, I don't have it. See, like, the, we got Simon back in. Welcome back, Simon. See, that's my point. Like, uh, that's why I was like, you know what? I'm going to start doing the uh, exclusive Pokemon as well, because you never know. Somebody might uh, might actually need them or get them for somebody else or, you know, things like that. Plus, you get items from it. Not the best items, but still. And we have, I believe that is Tito. We have Tito in as well. So we have a full team. Uh, I am going to switch Pokemon. I did forget to do that before we started this one. So I'm going to use Iron Hands again for it. All right, there we go. I believe that's Tito anyways, if I remember correctly. I try to remember everybody's um, I try to remember everybody's uh, in-game name. Sometimes like I have problems remembering them. I'm like, okay, I don't remember who that is. And just kind of go from there. So we got a full team. Let's do this, guys. If I remember, his normal typing is Dragon and Poison, but his terror type for this is Electric, so that makes it a little bit hard. So that's why I didn't pick Esmeral right there, was due to the fact it was Poison typing. But either way, I believe in us. Uh, Martin says, I just need to complete the Pokedex, and that's it. Ah... Uh, I still need to do that for Pokemon Violet. Almost at Scarlet, that's one we're playing. I need to do it for Violet, so that way uh, we can go Shiny Hunt and Paradox Pokemon in that game. But I also have to get some Urban Mystica as well, unfortunately. And we have officially been live for one hour, everybody. Okay, so now we're just going to Drain Punch him until we, uh, until we get rid of his health. Which, like I said, this was Byron's um, Iron Hands. I was great ready. And then uh, we were able to give him a shiny Iron Hands, so he gave us uh, his raid, his past raid ready one. Nope, not that one. Not that move. <clears throat> Martin says, yeah, snap, bro. Pokemon snap. But yeah, like, uh, definitely want to get all, I, I just want to get all the Paradox Pokemon shiny uh, in my name. Uh, MJ says, I need that raid. Do you need the Pokemon, MJ? Uh, it was full, MJ. Uh, if you need the Pokemon, I'll catch it and give it to you really quick. So let me know if we beat it. If not, you know how we do it. We get it back up to do. Like I say, if there's a Pokemon you guys need, but the raid is full, just let me know in chat. I'll catch it to you and give it to you really quick. That is no problem. Or MJ says thank you. Okay, yeah, so she needs it. So don't worry, MJ. I'll catch him for you and just trade him to you really quick. That is if we beat him. I think we got this one, without a doubt. MJ says I want some herbs, too. Yes, I... I definitely, definitely need some merch. Hey, what's up, Split? Split says it freaking snowed this morning. I still haven't got any snow this year. I don't think I'm going to, unfortunately. Uh, for people who get snow every year, like, uh, I can imagine it does get tiresome, but for someone who uh, sees snow, like, maybe every two or three years, uh, it's very, very exciting to be able to get it. Plus, I love the cold weather. Okay, so we broke his shield. Alright, so... Alright, he hit me. That's no worries. So I just gotta keep in mind, I do have to catch this one for MJ. Oh, no, we lost it. Oh, GG's. GG's. It's all good, though. We'll get it back up. Uh, I need Skrelp, too. Well, you can breed him to get Skrelp. 
Uh, Split says, I'll put some in a cup and mail it. And I'll mail it. I think it would melt at that point, unfortunately, Split. Uh, I would love some snow right now, though. Like, it's a little... It's not too warm or too cold. It's like 50... It's like 50 degrees right now. Uh, but my weather is so damn bipolar, it'll probably be like 70 tomorrow. <clears throat> okay, so let's go ahead and get this one back up. Uh... Split says, guess who wants some bacon again? You, absolutely. <laughs> you want bacon, of course. Simon says, I will stay at... Dude, Simon, like I said, man, win or lose, it doesn't matter as long as we're having fun. Like, keep going for it. I do need to switch Pokemon. I'll switch Pokemon after we get uh, <clears throat> everybody for it. Uh, Martin says, I want some herbs, too, dude. Need I need that Herba Mystica to keep our shiny hunt going, because unfortunately, we've been finding shinies. It's just... The Pokemon that I don't personally need right now for my collection. Uh, Splo says, I would kill for 50 degrees right now, shaking my head, dude. Take it. Take it and give me the snow. We got Sue back in. Welcome back, Sue. We got Tito back in. Welcome back, Tito. And we got room for one more person. Uh, Splo says, I got herbs, I just don't use them. Uh, I would highly recommend for you, Spliff, uh, before you use your Urban Mystica, to get the Shiny Charm. You know, complete your Pokedex, because that way it'll make it so it's 1 in 512. Same as Masuda Method for uh, getting it. Simon says, so other people can have a go. All right, man. All right, no worries. And we got room for one more chat. And we got MJ back in. Welcome back in. Okay, so since we have all of them, I'm going to switch back over to Iron Hands. Just because my Azumarill is not good for this raid because of the poison effect. And plus with the uh, Belly Drum and Drain Punch, like I'll pretty much have full health the entire time going forward. So we are good to do this one. Because like I said, I think I have enough for five sandwiches right now. And it kind of it kind of hurts, like uh, for everybody that watched yesterday's session. Every time I have to reset, even when we have shinies, but it's ones we don't have done. Uh, Split says, "Yeah, I need my dex done, girl. I could just generate the ones that are hard to find in the exclusives." Those that makes it baby. Yeah, that is true. I do it the hard way. I do it the hard way. <laughs> uh, which is perfectly fine to me. All right. So, I'm going to go ahead and ready up <clears throat> so we can get uh, this raid started. Yeah, because I want to say, like, um, doing, doing the, just trying to get all the Pokemon done for the decks, like, after I beat the game, which I had, like, I want to say about 140-ish Pokemon, it probably took me about... 18 and 19 hours to do. So, like, it, it takes a while, definitely, to get the uh, Pokedex complete. Like, last time we played uh, Violet, uh, last time we played Violet, I believe I got uh, about almost 300, I want to say 300 for it. Split says, yeah, because you love raging for hours looking at the same Pokemon. It just gets annoying at some points. Like, uh, oh god, I'm the imposter. <laughs> um, it just gets annoying like when you're trying to find certain Pokemon, and they just literally don't show up at all. Uh, Martin says, that's why I'm not fussy at the moment about herbs till I complete the night. See, that's a very, very good, good thing to do. MJ says, I'm going to try Ditto. Hey, yeah, go for it. Alright, so we're going to do Drain Punch. Like I said, though, my Azumarill would not be good against anything that has poison typing. That actually is poison, I should say that. Uh, like, for example, this Pokemon. Like, if it's one that has its Terra type as poison, then we're fine. But other than that, it uh, can get somewhat annoying. All right. So let's go ahead and drain punch channel. 
Actually, I don't remember what he looks like shiny, come to think of it. I remember what uh, Kralomsher looks like. It has a really, really cool red color to him. Him, I don't remember. I'd have to look that up, what he looks like shiny. Mart says, I just need these Scarlet exclusives. <laughs> uh, that's what I'm playing right now, my man. Like, uh... Maybe somebody here in the community can help you out, Martin. Like, if you're just looking to touch trade, too, you know, obviously let the person know, like, hey, I'm just trying to touch trade, especially for, like, legendary Pokemon. But speaking of legendary Pokemon, uh, we will have both Coridon and Maridon and Golden Ghoul for tomorrow. And if somebody picks them, um, you know, how it is, like how we did last time. If you, if you need one and you pick them, then you also get to have a... Um, you also get to pick a shiny Pokemon as well. Uh, Martin says, I, uh, or I'm sorry, I read that one. Uh, Spliff says, I'm going to get the bacon. All right, go get your bacon, Spliff. Sue says, I got them all. Hey, very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, Spliff says, I can try to generate uh, some you need. Hey, much love, Spliff. Much love to you. I'm pretty sure we got them this time. See, like, even if it poisons me, it's not going to do all that much uh, damage. Yeah. I don't know why. It went from being zoomed out to now being zoomed in. But also, we're going to... Uh, I didn't check to see if the um, glitch was gone for the uh, health bar, so we'll have to check that out. Okay, yeah, we beat him. GG's, guys. GG's. He is defeated. Spliff says, anything for the community? Hey, I appreciate it, Spliff. You know I do, dude. Well, he's defeated, just waiting for the game. Okay, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Alright, so don't catch for me and see if uh, we got near of a mystic. No Urba Mystica, unfortunately. Our luck is just not good today, chat. Man. Alright, I'm gonna check to make sure that I am caught up on everything. Uh, of course I wasn't. We have Spliff with the heart. Thank you, Spliff. Much, much appreciated. Alright, so now we need to go find ourselves another part. So, like, these two right here, I'm not even gonna bother checking, because again... We're not going to get any Urban Mystica from them. So let's go here. And uh, check that. Alright. Oh, I forgot to do that. Uh, uh, or, I'm sorry, Danielle says, On video chat with Colin, so cute. He ignores me. I don't know what's up with him. He just ignores me. Uh, Split says, my toes are freezing, it shouldn't be this cold. Uh, Martin says to Spliff, that would be ace, buddy, no worries if you can't, though. And, uh, Split says, I'm missing the baby. Well, both, uh, Danielle and Mitchell are on, uh, Discord voice chat, Spliff. Um, Split says, nah, yeah, definitely, uh, Guy, you just let me know which mons you need and how you would like them. There we go. Five. He's unfortunately poison type, so I'm gonna have to switch. He's poison and electric as a normal type, so yeah, he uh, Esmeralda would definitely not be good for this one. But let's go ahead and get that code up. Uh, Daniel says I'm crying. He's so cute. Peekaboo made him laugh. He just stares at me and like who? He's just like who the fuck are you? And I'm like okay. <laughs> Even with the even with the camera on, like he just straight up ignores me. I'm like, okay. For people wondering, we're talking we're talking about a baby here. Uh who likes Danielle, but like most things uh in life, absolutely hates me. We got Tito back in. Welcome back, Tito. Uh We'll do that. We got MJ back in. Welcome back, MJ. And we got room for one more person. 
Like I said, we'll probably do raids until we hit the two hour mark for today, and then do a shiny sandwich twice for uh, Roaring Moon to see if we can't get him shiny today. I doubt it, but hey, you never know unless you try. Alrighty. Uh, Split says, Colin makes me want a son, I swear. Uh, we, and we have Daniel back in. Welcome back, Daniel. I, we, I don't want children. I, I, I don't want children. Uh, Tito says, I hope you luck with the, uh, hope you have luck with the Paradox, uh, settlement. Dude, we are literally only missing two for, uh, Scarlet. And then after that, uh, we'll be able to go and finish the decks for, uh, go and try to finish the decks for Violet. And then Shiny Hunt on there as well, as do raids. But I'll have to do that off stream, uh, most likely. Whenever I get time, of course, to do, um, to go and get the Pokemon. Uh, for the decks as well as, uh, we'll do, we'll do, obviously we'll do raids on there. It's just, uh, I don't have any Earth Mystica in that game, unfortunately. Daniel says he turned the camera off. Of course he did. That's what he does best. All right. So we're going to belly drum. I feel like this one's going to take us a minute, because Toxicity is pretty hard. He was also one of my favorites from last gen, especially uh, when they finally released his Gigantamax form. I was so happy about that. He poisoned us, but that's okay, because we got our drain, uh, drain Punch. So yeah, I'm pretty sure we got this one, with that Drain Punch and the way everyone's looking so far. I want to say, I want to say I had him shiny in the last game. Not as a gigant Gigantamax, but uh, thanks to the uh, Isle of Armor DLC, any Pokemon besides Melmetal, you could turn into a Gigantamax Pokemon. Uh, if so, I, I definitely need to check one day, see what I have on that game. Uh, Martin says, you legend. Hey, much love to you, Martin. Like I said, we help each other out here. We help each other out here. My phone just went off. Okay, so we got rid of our belly drum. That's okay, because we could do it again. Alright, so belly drum. We still got plenty of time for this one, too. He had a pretty cool shiny, too. Instead of being purple, he was uh, pink. Not the best shiny, without a doubt, from that generation, but still a pretty decent one. So who knows? Maybe one day we'll shiny hunt for him, him in this game. Ooh, he killed me, but that was my first step, so it is all good. He is faster than me, unfortunately. But his shield is broke, so he's probably done for. Hunt says his attack's hiding, so we'll probably go ahead and... Yeah, it's, especially since we don't have that much time left, we'll just hit him. There we go. <laughs> hey, we got, a, we got a crit hit, too, on him. GG's, guys. Uh, so says, yeah, dude, if you aren't in the Discord, just DM me on here and we can discuss it there. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, Martin says, you know me, though, buddy, I don't like it. I don't like asking either. I don't like Hey, we got, finally, 
One piece of Herba Mystica. There we go. Yeah, I don't like asking for Pokemon for myself. Like, for the community? Absolutely. For myself? No. <laughs> but I'm also very, I'm a very, very stubborn person, according to my friends. Alright, so we beat that one. Hell yes. Let's go check out this one and just kind of go from there. At least we got one piece so far today. One piece is better than none at all. Daniel says, hey. I'm glad we got one at least, Daniel. Because like I said, it's, we didn't get any yesterday. So I was like, oh no. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and climb this to uh, see what this rate is. Alright. See if this is a five star for us. Not only is it a five star, it's a five star I hate. It is a Pokemon that is the bane of my existence. A Pokemon I really, really wish would disappear forever. Ugh. Like, no, I legitimately hate this Pokemon. I hate it so, so much. In fact, uh, Danielle, as a joke, gave us one to give away for tomorrow's uh, session. That and Amoongus. And I was like, oh no. Why? Uh, but, alright. Code is up, chat. Let's get this done. Uh, Split so says, I don't know if the sandwich method is still working for Amoongus 6-star. But if it is, you should definitely try it. I got seven herbs per per raid. Ah, uh, I don't know. See, like, here's the thing. I'm not, I can't confirm it, but it does feel like after um, Cinderace came out that they nerfed the amount that we get in each raid. I, I don't know if it's true if or if we're just getting incredibly unlucky with them. Uh, we got MJ back in. Welcome back, MJ. It just feels like that. We got Danielle back in. Welcome back, Danielle. And we also got Tito back in. Welcome back, Tito. Uh, Martin says, yeah, I'm in the Discord, buddy. All right, sweet. See, I can never remember who's all in the Discord and who is not. Uh, I know there's a couple of community members here who don't use Discord, which is perfectly, uh, which is perfectly understandable. Uh, but... It, uh, so that way, like, we try to get them what we can here while we're live. Uh, Split says they could have nerfed it. Yeah. Re See, like, I feel like they could, they possibly... I'm not confirming it. Uh, again, take it with a grain of salt, but it feels like they definitely uh, made it so it's a l way, way harder to get than last time. I'll have to do some research to make sure of it. Also, I forgot to mention this uh, during yesterday's session, but uh, Jonathan, a community member here, was... Um, Asking if the uh, DLC rumor thing uh, was a legitimate like uh, video slash thing, and I can confirm to you, it was not. It was in fact uh, from a fan trailer. It was from a fan made uh, Pokemon website, so it was not a legitimate one. I went back on the actual Pokemon Facebook page and uh, went all the way back to before this game. Uh, right before this game came out, went up, and there was nothing. So the rumors of DLC right now are just what they are, rumors. Not true right now. Ooh. I see Danielle's shiny Flareon. Okay, so we're going to belly drum, and we're going to do one drain punch, and then we're just going to ice punch him uh, to get our health back, and to uh, just kind of go from there. Alright, so my defense fell. That's okay. You, at, he already got rid of my belly drum. Are you kidding me? He's probably going to kill me. I hate this Pokemon. I legitimately hate this Pokemon. Ah, uh, your stupid smug squirrel face.
He's so bad. I'm sorry. I, I really... Ri Some people think I'm joking when I say I don't like this Pokemon. I, re I legitimately despise this Pokemon. <laughs> Say much help. We got that. We only got 60, so yeah. Unfortunately, I'm going to keep using Drain Punch for a little bit, unless he kills me right here. Okay, he killed me. That's okay, though. Uh, Spill says, I don't know your uh what your name is, and, uh, is, but in the Discord, I'm Anakin Skywalker, lol. Uh, just click on my profile and shoot me a DM. Yes, yes. See, so, yeah, that's why it's always confusing to remember who's in the Discord and who's not, because everybody uses different names, and I'm just like, I don't know who's who. But some people, when they do uh, do a direct message to me, they'll let me know, like, hey, it's uh, so-and-so from uh, the community, and just kind of go from there. And I'm like, okay, cool, cool. All right, uh, since Drain Punch isn't doing that much, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, heal us up and kind of go from there. And I'll check. Uh, I'll check uh, in a minute too to make sure that there's no sort of notifications that I miss. Okay, so now I'm just gonna ice punch him. Maybe we'll freeze him. We'll maybe freeze a stupid squirrel Pokemon. He's also raising his defense each time he does that, so that's that's unfortunate. Ooh, and Daniel just died. Like I said, I really, really hate this Pokemon. <laughs> uh, we're probably going to have to do him again, too. No! If he didn't use his damn uh, uh, raid ability to get rid of my uh, belly drum right when I did it, I'm pretty sure we would have had him. Because that was the only unfortunate thing right there. Uh, GG's though. But we'll get it back up. Uh, as soon as I get the code, as soon as I switch Pokemon and get the code up, uh, I'm gonna run to the restroom really quick and just kind of go from there. Martin says, "Haha, I love the name. Yeah, I definitely will, bro. Nice one. All right, sweet. Very, very nice. All right, so we're just waiting for it to go back." Maybe. It takes forever when we lose a raid, but as soon as we actually win one, like, it goes back to the menu pretty quickly. Alright, so let me change Pokemon to our Iron Hands once again. Get the code up. Make sure it actually gets up. Okay, so I'll be right back, guys. I just gotta use the restroom real quick.
Sorry about that, everybody. All right, so we got MJ back in, we got Tito back in, and we got Danielle back in. Also, I want to see if I can raise this just for a minute, for a couple of minutes of comfort. All right. All right, sweet. Let us get this raid started. Oh, goodness. Uh, also, I'm going to check my phone to make sure there's no sort of reactions that I missed. If it'll hurry up. <laughs> Alright, I think we're good. Yes, we are good and caught up. Sweet. Alright, so go ahead and belly drum and just ice punch them. Ice punch. Hopefully it'll freeze them. That would be very, very nice. Alright, so he has a shield already, but that's okay, because we are going to destroy this stupid squirrel. I hate this squirrel so, so bad. I gotta heal up already in order to, uh, uh in order to do my belly drum. Uh, whoever designed Greed and a Game Freak, you deserve to be fired. This Pokemon is terrible. I can't even... I can't even, uh... Use my belly drum again. Are you kidding me? Daniel says, gotta love the squirrel. Dude, I hate this squirrel. I... I... I want the name of the person who designed him a Game Freak. So I could send him a very, very nice letter. Ugh. Snap, bro. Dude, I'm about to do a Thanos snap to get rid of Greedent from existing. All the Pokemon that just I absolutely hate. Just snap and get rid of all of them. And only leave us with the good one. And to change bad shinies. Somebody go get me the Infinity Stones. Good. Fuck you, you stupid squirrel. If <laughs> Chase says it was the same person who made Titus like, well, I want his name. I want his name and his address, MJ. Go get it for me. And we have officially been live for an hour and a half, everybody. Good. That squirrel deserves to be frozen. Uh. If anybody can guess, too, I, I want to see, like, who can guess, like, you already, you guys already know Greedent, and you already know Amoongus. What's another Pokemon that I absolutely hate? I'll, gi I'll give you guys a hint. It's from Gen 5. Well, it's, well, as you guys know, Gen 5 is my least favorite, but still. It's a Gen 5 Pokemon, and I'm just like, why do you exist? What are you? Oh, thank God his shield broke. Alright, uh, I'm not even gonna waste using Belly Drum at this point. I'm just gonna hit him. I want him dead. That didn't do anything, unfortunately. Uh, I just want this guy gone. I want him off my screen. Okay, so we're like, I didn't know what our, um, Terra type for this one is, because I, I very, very rarely use Terra ability. Are you? 
hitting me. Are you kidding me? I, I really wish I had a green ink card right now. I really wish I had a green ink card to show it abuse. Ugh. We'll get it back up. If we don't beat him again, then we're going to go find a new one. I hate this squirrel. This squirrel is the bane of my existence. I, I know who I'm going to use this time, though. It's time to bring out the big guns. It's time to bring out the best fucking Pokemon known to existence. Okay, there we go. Goat is up, chat. I, I, I really wish this Pokemon didn't exist. <laughs> oh, goodness. Every time, here's the thing, too. Every time we get him as a five star or a six star, he, he does some bullshit and beats us. We got MJ back in. Welcome back, MJ. Uh, we got Tito back in. Welcome back, Tito. I wish the I wish the squirrel from Ice Age would come and just beat his ass for us, chat. Oh, goodness. Tito's also coming out with the big guns. Ah, uh, so we'll wait until it gets to 45 seconds, and then go from there, chat. Tito says, yeah, dude, the big guns were needed, and we got Danielle in. Welcome back, Danielle. Oh, uh, God. I <laughs> After stream, when I go to trade uh, with Danielle here, I'm going to tell her, no, we don't need the squirrel. I, I'm pretty sure we're good. I'm pretty sure we're good. Uh, but then she'll tell me you take the squirrel and like it. I I know her way too well. Ooh, ooh! Somebody came prepared, big boy. Charizard shiny and big boy Arcanine shiny. Alright. So come on, Charizard. Keep hitting him each and every time. But we are tired of your shit, Greta. Uh, like I said, this Pokemon has been the bane of my existence for quite a long time. Uh, of course, I missed that one. That's right, though. We still have Hurricane as well. Uh, 
There we go. Plus, Hurricane uh, also has the. Uh, it also has a chance to confuse. Thank God. Oh, uh, so I guess he was confused because it just had it snap. He snapped out of it. All right, so let's go ahead and start hitting him with our hurricanes, and he's burned too, which is great. Uh, Martin says, I need a shiny Charmander so I can have a black Charizard. <laughs> um, we might have some. I'm not confirming or denying if we have some for tomorrow yet, Martin. I don't know. <laughs> uh, we have had him before. Uh, I will say that. We have had him before, though. Uh, what is my health? Okay, since my health is low, I'm gonna go ahead and do a heal real quick for everybody, because we know Dog will, will possibly go ahead and get him finished. Martin's curious now. See, like, I accidentally almost spoiled what, um, Angel, uh, already gave us for, uh, Shiny Sunday, which I gotta get in contact with her today, too, for it. Uh, during the stream, because, like, I forgot, when I went to go switch Pokemon, it, it dawned on me, like, oh, wait, nope, nope, that was the, la that was the box, because I always try to keep it a surprise, most of the time, I'm surprised, too, with, um, what we have, uh, when it comes to Shiny Sunday, to be able to give away. Martin says, I asked him for a Pikachu last, oh, uh, so, uh, we're not gonna be able to get any, uh, ones from Liam, I'm not gonna say why. Uh, this week, but let's just say uh, there all the moms that are coming to us uh, this shiny Sunday are coming from both Danielle and Angel. Which of course I always wait the very very usually wait the last day to get them, which I need to get better with. I need to get better with. All right, so he's on the burn might kill him. Nope, of course the burn didn't. We missed our hurricane, but we should definitely, definitely be good. He, he should be dead. Hopefully. I really hope he's dead. You can stop hitting me with Bullet Seat, you stupid... Stop! You are dead in the game. Uh, last week. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. And I know you did, bro. Thank God. I, I, uh, thank God we're done with them. He didn't even have the decency to drop us one piece of Urban Mystica. He left us a bottle cap. Uh, gee, gee, so. Mart says, oh, okay. And Daniel says, there we go. Finally, dude, I hate this squirrel. You know I hate him. Uh, Daniel says, I think I made a Pikachu for sh sh Shiny Sunday. Wow, I almost messed up my own, uh, words. Alright, sweet, Daniel. Sweet. Uh, okay, so, I think, yeah, we've checked those, so we need to go to, like, over here to check. So we'll go check this fairy one first, see what it is, and just kind of go from there. Because we have about, we got about 15 minutes or so left for, um, raids. Uh, Martin says, well, everyone, if there's a shiny Charmander, it is man. <laughs> Martin's gonna have his eyes glued. He's gonna have, like, 12 alarms set, his eyes glued to the stream at all times in order to uh, try to get a shiny Pokemon that he really, really wants. Uh, like I said, I can show, uh, I could show what we have already for Shiny Sunday, but it's not the way I like to do things. I like to leave it a mystery for you, chat. Uh, five star. Okay, there we go. There we go. So, go to up. There we go. Uh, like I said, we're only going for three hours today. Uh, just so I can get the rest of stuff done for Shiny Sunday. Danielle's going to be streaming as well, so I'm going to be in there for commentary. And also, uh, I get some cleaning I have to do off stream today as well, once I'm done with everything. But as you guys know, Sundays, I definitely try to go longer with. It's just every day, I at least try to hit three hours for the session. 
Uh, I do need to change Pokemon, though. I'm going to switch over to um, Iron Hands. Uh, because that is no bueno for, hit, uh, for my Zmurl. Alright, we got Danielle back in. Welcome back, Danielle. We got Tito back in. Welcome back, Tito. And we got MJ back in. Welcome back, MJ. So let me go ahead and switch Pokemon. We got Roger with the like. What's up, Roger? How are you doing today, good sir? I don't know why I have those Pokemon at the bottom. I really don't remember. I saw some Pokemon at the bottom of this uh, box, and I was like, I'll have to check to see exactly why they are in there. I don't remember if they're shiny or if like they're uh, just there to trade. Uh, Martin says, I only want them to, well, them two are at the top of my list. <laughs> hey, you never know what we have, my man. You'll never, ever know. So, yeah, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a lot of fun, though. We're going to have fun with it, as always. Like I said, I want to say, like, uh, Sundays are definitely our biggest day for a stream because of what we do for Sundays. Alright, so I'll go ahead and ready up and get this raid nice and started for us, chat. Uh... Yeah, I figured Charmander would be a very, very popular one, popular one to get. Um, without a doubt, I think we have some starters. I think we have some Paradox Pokemon as well. Not, like I said, not too sure what we have uh, for tomorrow's session uh, to give away, but we definitely have a lot, and we still have Pokemon left over from uh, last Shiny Sunday as well that we could give out. All right, sweet. Let us start this raid. Uh, Martin, you already know what I want, Shiny, but I want to catch it in my name, my man. And chat knows here as well. I really, really hope today's the day that we... Uh, get our Roaring Moon shiny. <laughs> uh, Martin says, ah, yeah, it's always good. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Like I said, it was just a random idea that I had um, on top of my head for, like, I was thinking of, like, names for different things, like, for, like, when we just play games, like, Let's Play, because, you know, it's recognizable and easy. And then I was like, what about for, sh I want to do, like, shiny hunts as well as give away shiny Pokemon, and, like, it just dawned on me, like, out of nowhere, eh, shiny Sunday. Sounds clever enough. In fact, I, I was... I don't remember what I was... I remember I was hanging out with my brother. My brother was over that day. And so I was like, eh. Yeah, that's not a bad name. He, he thought it was pretty good, too, which he doesn't think anything's good, I think, of most of the time. Martin says, yeah, I think we all know, bro. <laughs> Uh, we have Tanker uh, Tanker Cop Gaming with the like. Thank you so much, dude. How are you doing today? Uh, yeah. We've spent so long trying to get it. I would say, though, Sandy Shocks was probably worse because, like, when we were doing him, like, nothing was just appearing shiny for us at that point besides uh, a Palmy that we had to sacrifice but immediately got back during that, uh, during that. Alright, so the reason I'm using uh this instead of like drain punch drain punch won't do that much even with the uh, it all all up. I am gonna go ahead and heal though. Uh ooh, but okay. I was gonna heal because I saw it me and MJ both were uh, kinda down, but that's alright. I'll go ahead and heal me, Tito and Danielle. And then just kinda go from there. Hey, who knows dude, maybe today will be our lucky day to get him shiny. You never know. Alright, so Ice Punch him again. 
Alright, so our shield's almost broke, so I'm pretty sure we have this one. Hey, and he couldn't move again because he is paralyzed. Yes, his shield is broken. Very, very nice. One more hit, and he is done for, chat. There we go. That was easy. GG's. Alright, so don't catch him, but please have some Urban Mystica for us. No herb. We only got one piece today, but we did get an ability capsule. So I guess that's something? Alright, uh, where are we at for time? We're at an hour 50 minutes, so we'll try to do one more raid. We'll try to do one more 5 star. And then after that, we will uh, get up our shiny sandwich for uh, our Roaring Moon again. Alright, so that was the first one we checked, so let's go check this flying one over here and see what we got. But I think what we've been ch the change I made to where like uh, not only do we do raids but we also um, do a shiny hunt as well during the week. I, th I think those have been going really really well. Because like I said, typical. Okay. Uh, let's get our Iron Hands back, and challenge as a group. One more, no more. Well, no, because we still have to get, uh, Slitherwing. We, we still have to get Slitherwing, too, in our name. That's why I've been, I've been, po I've been pushing him off just due to the fact that Danielle did give us one. It's just like, I want them all in my name. That's how stubborn I am when it comes to uh, shiny hunts and getting shiny Pokemon, is I like having them in my name. Without a doubt. And plus, she nicknamed it Boob. <laughs> she nicknamed it Slitherwing Boob. Uh, but yeah, the game is pretty much like, you get one herb, and that's it. And now when I see Danielle play it, uh, we got Richard in. Welcome, Rich. We got Tito in, and we got room for one more. When I see Danielle play it, though, um, off stream, uh, for both me and her, like she'll send me screenshots of like, yeah, I found this shiny, or hey, I just got like a million Herba Mystica, and I'm just like over here like, bruh, how do I not get that lucky? What the hell? And we got MJ in as well. Alright. So Axorus can be... A, he Depending on like what his Terra type is, he can be pretty tough. I don't think we've ever fought him with a flying type one before. I could be mistaken. We got Danielle laughing as well. Yeah. She, Pokemon, she has given me some shiny Pokemon, which is really, really nice of her. But she keeps fucking with me every time. She gives us one chat. Because we have, she knows for a fact, I wanted Shiny Ghastly and Arceus. Somehow I didn't get that, but I ended up getting a Gengar and a Haunter before Ghastly. So she gave me a uh, Shiny Ghastly called Ghost Balls. And same thing with Psyduck. I got Golduck, but I didn't get Psyduck, so she gave me one called D's Nuts. Slitherwing, the Boob, and something else. I don't remember what the other thing was. I'll have to check it out. It's a woman thing, bro. No, it's a Danielle thing. It's a Danielle thing. She loves fucking with me. Oh, no, I'm too er nervous to eat berries. Alright, so my attack was heightened. Very nice. Uh, Belly drum, and then wild charge, I guess? I've never used wild charge on this Pokemon, I don't think. Ooh, he is our, yeah, this one, uh, pretty sure we got it. <laughs> like I said, I don't remember what Wild Charge does. It's been a while since I've seen that move. All right, so I got rid of his next vet. Do not do what the Greedent did. You son of a bitch. Right as I've said something, why is my timing so damn good for it? That happened earlier today in stream, too. I, I am just so damn unlucky when it comes to what I say, and then it actually comes true. 
search history was like, well, just say something positive and like a million dollars pops up. I guess that's going to damage me a little bit, but that's okay. Ooh, maybe. Alright, so yeah, this one's this one's way easier than the other ones that we've done. Alright, so we got rid of our effects again. Uh, we'll just use Ice Punk. He's dead. I, just, I wanted to go ahead and my saw on his little health bar. Yeah, he was dead. That was super fast. Oh my god. Uh, let me see if that was. Uh, that was Discord. Alright, so I don't need to catch him because he is not a shiny boy for us. Uh, I did. Uh, we have Richard with the heart, Martin with the heart as well. Thank you guys so much. And of course, no Herba Mystica, unfortunately. But that's okay, because uh, now we are going to do two shiny sandwiches in hopes of getting our Roaring Moon. That is a Pokemon I've been wanting to get shiny for quite a long time now. Like, we have done him, We I want to say, like, we've done him more than Sandy Shocks up at this point. And thankfully we're done with him. We don't ever need him again, thank God. Shiny. Because, like, in fact, I almost ran from the shiny because I could not tell he was shiny there for a minute. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and throw down a save. And then pull up our picnic to get our dragon sandwich started. Like I said, we have enough time to do two of them because of effects lasting for 30 minutes. And then after that, I'm going to go get the rest of the Pokemon uh, for uh, tomorrow's session. So tomato, onion, bell pepper, two avocado, and a hamburger, and then two of these boys. Uh, shut up, Mitchell. Mitchell says tiny uh, snake man, Blake. <laughs> Martin, I you you did the fingers crossing. I thought you put up the middle finger emoji. Like, what did I do, Martin? <laughs> like on my screen, it looks like a middle finger. But all right. Let's see if we can get our shiny. We've been getting shiny dragons, don't get me wrong. Uh, but it's not the right one. Uh, MJ says, what was the Pokemon you hated from Gen? Oh, I was seeing if chat can guess what it is. Uh, I did not say what it was. There was a lot of Pokemon. Gen 5, I barely have any Pokemon I actually like from that generation. But there was one that I was, I just thought was so terrible and I was like, why do you exist? Like, and whoever, I'll tell you what, whoever can guess it, and guess correctly, and I'm not giving any more hints, it is gen, it's a Generation 5 Pokemon. Uh, I'll give you two shiny Pokemon today. Daniel the snake emoji. Fuck off with the snakes. <laughs> Fuck off with the snake. I hate snakes. Uh, Martin says, yeah, I thought he was going to carry a... Uh, a walking path. Dude, I almost did. I almost did. Even, like, uh, Peyton was like, no. <laughs> but, thankfully I didn't. I checked out his feet and was like, something's different about this one. It was lighting down there, because he is a gold color. Gold, almost bronze, but that didn't show up because of the lighting effect down there. So, yeah, we almost ran away from him. I would have probably cried. I, You probably would have seen a grown man cry in defeat over that Pokemon. Martin says, no, not today, bro. Uh, but yeah, like, a, uh, why do you not put the bread, uh, piece of bread on it, and can I have a hint? That's, that is your hint, MJ. It's a Gen 5 Pokemon that I absolutely hate, and I'm just like, why do you exist? Like, that is your hint, <laughs> Mitchell. Mitchell says, Blake, we love, Blake, we love you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Richard says the garbage one. Good guess. I don't like that Pokemon either. But good, no, it, I don't like that Pokemon either, but good, good guess. I said, Generation 5 to me was just a really, really bad generation. I had some, it had some cool Pokemon cards, but other than that, like, other than that, I, I couldn't get into the anime. I didn't like the, uh, changes, uh, made to, like, how they were trying to reboot it with Ash, but, it didn't work at all. 
for it, and a certain Pokemon. Like, I, I still, even today, when I went and replayed Pokemon White, uh, I was just like, why are you a thing? Uh, Mitchell says, Blake, you have nothing to be ashamed of with your micro snitch. Shut up, Mitchell. Uh, MJ says the ice cream one, the sandcastle. Nope and nope. Uh, Daniel says Wobbuffet. That's generation two. I actually like Wobbuffet. Uh, Mitchell says it's not the size you think, but how you. Okay, I'm gonna stop just reading Mitchell's comments. MJ says Jesus. He he likes fucking with me. Without a doubt. Oh, God. I was going to say, don't make me whip it out in front of chat, Mitchell. Okay, so no to these guys. Again, we're looking for Roaring Moon. Like him, our green boy, and I really, really hope so. So that way, we can be done with the Paradox Pokemon. Besides Slitherwing. We still got to get Slitherwing, but he shouldn't be too, too bad. I didn't like those. See, same. G generation 5 to me is still the worst generation. And it's not only in terms of designs of the Pokemon, but the story was really, really lame to me. The legendary Pokemon, there were two, there, uh, the fact there were so many of them, and more doesn't always mean better. Uh, shinies, there's some I like for that gen, but most of them are just kind of like, eh, too. Uh, MJ says, I love all Pokemon, but Ice Cream and Sandcastle appalled me. I don't blame you. I do not blame you. Uh, Martin says, it's all good. My phone doesn't zoom in that much, so I'll be fine. Fuck you. Fuck you, Martin. <laughs> Mitchell says, do you hate Munchlikes because you're a Snorlax? God damn it. Uh, I'm gonna do a stream one day where I just sleep and see how much, how many donations I can get. Richard says, who's the Pokemon? Okay, so does everybody give up on their guess? Does everybody give up on their guess? Because if so, that forfeits the two, uh, the two shinies I talked about. What's it? St it starts with a W. It start I will say that it starts... I'll give you... That's your last hint, Chet. Gen 5 starts with a W. Uh, all right i hope the sandwich is not a dud for us and we have officially been live for two hours everybody and for the shiny po it'll be uh it'll be for uh the ones we have left over i don't want to show like what we have new uh, Richard says Gen 5, right? Yep, it is Generation 5. Generation 5 and starts with a W. Uh, Mitchell says, Richard got it. Richard got it. It's Watchhog. It is what. No, actually, I didn't mind Whirlpeed, Danielle. That one was okay. Yep, it is Watchhog. I absolutely wonder, like, why that Pokemon exists. So, Richard, uh, after the sandwich ends... Uh, I'll get you two shiny Pokemon, my man. <laughs> Mitchell says Wooper. No, I actually like Wooper. Especially like in uh, Heart Gold and Soul Silver, the sprite, when he looks back at you and just goes, Woo! <laughs> MJ said Woobat. No, it wasn't Woobat. Uh, it was, in fact, Watchhog. Well, he put Watchdog, but I know, I know what he meant. Like, that Pokemon, every time I see it, and it's a Gen Leader's Ace Pokemon, too. And I'm just like, why? That Pokemon is so bad. Not only in terms of stats, but in also in terms of design, it's just terrible. Richard says, agree with you, a watch. Yeah, dude, he's, oh my god. Every time I see him, I get immediately annoyed. Same with Greta. Like, I don't know what it is up with those two, but those two are just fucking terrible to me. I'm a, Mitchell says, I'm a whooper your ass, boy. Uh -huh, you and what army? You don't have enough hands for this ass, bitch. Alright. But yeah, like I said, Richard, uh, 
autocorrect uh, keeps uh, keeps autocorrect me. No, no, you're good. I I knew exactly what you meant. I figured if autocorrect was uh who was he was the fucking uh oh god. How do I even describe what this Pokemon looks like? You can find he was Patrat's uh for uh he was the evolution for Patrat. Uh, you can find like him in the uh tall grass like as soon as you begin generation five. And he was like a fucking tall, big eyed, crazy looking uh uh animal thing that always had its arms crossed, looked mad, just doing like that and his sprite. And he was so bad after generation five you could not find him in the wild if I remember right. I think that was the last game he was in was in uh Black and White One and Two. I could be wrong. He could have been in another one, but that was the last one I remember him from. And I absolutely hated that Pokemon. Like, I thought Badoof was bad for a while. Like, uh, Badoof's kind of grown on me a little bit more. Uh, B-Barrel, though, like, nah. B-Barrel, though, could go straight to hell. That Pokemon sucks. The reason I think I changed my mind a little bit more about the doof was because of um this uh parody of uh Pokemon it was called Pokemon uh, Rusty. Uh where this guy who was just like a very, very bad Pokemon trainer, but he ended up getting a perfect Badoof that he named uh Peanut Butter or P B, which stood for perfect Badoof, which is what I have mine uh that Danielle gave me nickname to on uh Pokemon Arceus. Uh, but yeah, Watch Hog was, Watch Hog. Yep, that's Pokemon MJ. Uh, Daniel says, "Gonna try to get Roaring Moon with you." All right, go for it, Daniel. Enjoy your thirty uh Zwellius's that you get shiny. Uh, you definitely have the Urban Mist to go for it. I do not, unfortunately. That's why I'm kind of hoping we don't find anything besides Roaring Moon shiny down here. But also, uh, since Richard did in fact guess the Pokemon correctly, uh, I will in fact like if he's still watching by the time uh this this first sandwich ends and we don't get it and reset, uh, I will get it to him. We have Nolan with like what's up, Nolan? Uh, how are you doing today? And MJ says I hated the dude, but I like him now. Same, I was the same boat. Like he is such a mean Pokemon though. Like he. He even got his own song on the official Pokemon uh, YouTube channel, which I thought was kind of cool. Same with Magikarp. Like, the Magikarp song I thought was really, really good. Uh, Danielle says, Badoof is Sir Fluffy Butt to me. Well, he is Peanut Butter to me. Which, if I ever get another one, I'll name him Sir Fluffy Butt and send him to you, Danielle. Because I haven't played that one in a while. Ah, uh, no to him. I remember one per uh I remember uh a lot of people too, speaking of Badoof and uh just Pokemon in general, a lot of people really did not like Diamond and Pearl remakes, which I I liked them. They were fine. Like yeah, I will admit they were probably the worst remakes um that we ever got. But they were still good games to me. Because I have seen, uh, there are some mods that uh, fans have been doing to improve the game's quality. Like, uh, one person added, like, uh, there's slowly, like, uh, these are mods, too. These aren't legitimate things, so don't think they're real. Uh, one person went and started adding, like, all the other generation of Pokemon into the game. Uh, smoother textures and uh, some other stuff that was actually cool. They brought, like, Z moves and Mega Evolutions into it and Gigantamax. It, it was pretty cool the way the mods were on there. Like there, I saw them originally, I want to say on Facebook or YouTube. It was one of those two. And I thought they were really, really cool. Uh, Nolan says, is there a map somewhere to see where all the stakes to get the legendary Pokemon are in Scarlet? Uh, there are, Nolan, there possibly is online. Uh, to get them, like, I followed a video, uh, to show where they all were. Like, if you want a good video, 
to show where they are and like show where you need to uh, possibly uh, fly to to get it. I recommend the Austin John Plays video over on his uh, YouTube channel for uh, that. That's what I followed for it. Because, like, they they can take a while. I will say that. Ah, oh, will you show up green already, Mr. Dragon? Watch Danielle get him, though, like, way before us, chat. Like, something, something is telling me that she's going to get him before we do here on uh while streaming it and uh it's gonna be unfortunate but yeah to answer your question nolan i uh i pretty sure there probably are like pictures out there but like i said i just followed the austin john plays video in order to uh to find all of them because it made it way easier it took, it took like maybe maybe like 40 ish minutes to find all of them because, like, I had to keep going back and forth, back and forth. Uh, Nolan says, okay, cool, thank you. You're welcome, man. You are welcome. Unfortunately, they don't show up in the game. And some of them, some of them are super, super easy to find. And then some of them, like, you would not be able to tell where they are. It's easier to spot them at night, though, I will say that. Like, nighttime, uh, for those stakes are way easier to spot than daytime. Same with, like, the, uh, Spirit Tube orbs from, uh, Arceus. Like, way easier at night than the day. Well, there's one in the wall, but I can't tell if he's shiny or not. I don't think he is. Hey, you get away from me, crawl boy. Ah, oh, goodness. Really, really hoping we get him today. Chad, that would be fantastic. Mitchell says, I'll now bow down to the all-powerful God Badoof. <laughs> Lord Badoof, please give us our shiny we want. Funny thing is, last time I sang the uh, shiny song that I made up for anybody uh, here that knows what I'm talking about, we did get Sandy Shocks like soon after, which was kind of funny. It was all the power of that song, baby. Oh, show up green already. Oh, man. Like, like I said, I'm hoping we get him today. But something's telling me that Danielle is going to get him well before us, chat. Ah. Uh. He's definitely a cool Pokemon, though, to uh, hunt down, though, without a doubt. It's just like I said earlier uh, this week, like, I knew for a fact him and Sandy Shocks were going to give us the most trouble to obtain Shiny, which I, so far, have been correct on. Like I said, I don't think he spawns on top of that ridge. I think he's always going to be on the ground for us. Uh, so no to them, no to that one, trying to open up my drink one-handed right now while checking out these Pokemon, make sure they're not beautiful, sparkly, green, and shiny. I'll just leave the cap off, I'm not clumsy, thankfully. Most of the time, I drop mainly, like, pens and vapors uh, on the ground. Let's see, anything over here? How much time do we have left for this one? We got about half time for the sandwich. Alright, so, no to that one. Hmm. I think that's gonna disappoint me too. Say it's like um, 
for example, how Chansey spawns down here as well as Weasel. Like, if one of them ends up being shiny, we have to reset to save our Herbal Mystica, unfortunately. But I will say, uh, you are f Okay, okay. I thought we found a, uh, okay, we're good. I thought we found a shiny Gibble. There, it was just, uh, Gold Duck's nose <laughs> made it look like the belly. Oh, I was gonna say, are you kidding me right now? Uh, I was gonna say, like, that is another gibble that we have to, unfortunately, uh, say goodbye to. In fact, I remember, uh, one day during the week, in fact, back before I was like, okay, we gotta save the Urban Mystica. We did find a, I believe it was a, it was Palmo. We found Shiny Palmo down here, who was not, um, who was not affected by the sandwich Shiny, which I thought was kind of weird, so I was like, okay, I'll take him. Which, I already had Palmy. So, uh, when we got, uh, Sandy Shock Shiny and ended up finding another one of him, uh, Shiny as well, it made it, uh, definitely, definitely more easy, uh, to be able to finish that line. So now I can have an entire line of him completely Shiny, which is great. Okay. So if our dragon wants to show up green, that would, again, be fantastic. We we need it, chat. We definitely need it. Ah, come on, you ancient Salamence. I remember, too, the last run that we did um, yesterday, in fact, Right before we entered this cave, like the little cave entrance, there's a shiny Zwellius just waiting for us, chilling. Uh, and I was like, are you kidding me? But we, I think, yeah, we got two of him in a row, in fact. The only problem was uh, we uh, couldn't save because we didn't get a Roaring Moon. Alright, so no to anything up here. And like I said, after the sandwich too, um, Richard, if you are still around, my man, I will get you uh, two of uh, shiny Pokemon. Because you guessed correctly on uh, the other po uh, Pokemon. I'm just like, why do you exist? <laughs> okay, so no to him. In fact, one day, uh, this if we don't get him today, uh, depending on like how things are Monday, we might just spend the entire stream that day trying to see if we can get our Roaring Moon shiny. Because he has evaded us for way too long, chat. He has evaded us for way, way, way too long. Richard said, sweet. Yeah, bro, like I said, I'm a man of my word. You guessed correctly, so you get two shiny boys. Uh, speaking of shiny boys, come on, Roaring Moon. <laughs> uh, I really don't want to have to s sing the shiny song either. <sighs> Goodness. Apologies, chat. Ah, oh, man. We've seen him so many times, too. And unfortunately, he just does not want to appear for us. Now I have other Pokemon, too, that I definitely want to um, go and shiny hunt later on. It's just once I get into one, once I get into one hunt for a Pokemon, I definitely, definitely, definitely like uh, can't stop until we get it. Because uh, I know some people like uh, when they shiny hunt, 
they'll uh, sometimes they'll take a break, which is not too bad, and try to go for something else. However, I am so stubborn, chat, that I have to get that Pokemon shiny, or else like it'll drive me insane. Goodness. My apologies for I don't know what is going on with me right now. I don't know why I'm yawning so much. All right. So we haven't. Good thing is though we don't have to sacrifice any shiny so far. Like, uh, we haven't found anything sparkly down here, which is not a bad thing at all, because like I said, I absolutely hate having to, uh, restart the game after we get a shiny Pokemon, because we've had to do that with, uh, six now, unfortunately. But luckily, they were ones that I already had shiny, and they weren't anything that, uh, wasn't added or needed for the collection. So that was a good thing. Still sucks, yes, but at the same time, it could have been a lot worse. Alright, uh, so no to you. Is there any up here? Come to think of it too, one of the first times um we were hunting for a uh, Roaring Moon Shiny here on stream. We found uh, Shiny Zuelius, but I was paying attention to chat and uh, didn't realize I accidentally hit him and had to watch as uh, we accidentally killed him. But thankfully, we did end up finding another one to get redeemed on him. I uh, wonder how Danielle's doing with her Shiny Hunt, too, for him. Because, like, every time I've seen her do this, she always usually ends up with a shiny Zoelius. And I believe the last time she did this, she did end up getting a shiny Gibble, which she did not have, which is great. All right. So how much time do we got left for this one? We still got six minutes. So six minutes left. And then after that, we will reset. Uh, but before we get the... Uh, but before we get it, uh, we will give Richard here his two shiny Pokemon. We got Dylan with the like. What's up, Dylan? How are you doing today, bro? Uh, Daniel says nothing yet. Mitchell says Daniel just got... Ah, uh -huh, sure she did, Mitchell. Dylan says, hi, everyone. How are you doing today? Doing all right, man. Doing all right. Doing our, uh, our daily Roaring Moon check, as you know. How are you doing today, Dylan? Oop, get away from me, Chansey. Ah, oh, man. Daniel's also doing this, uh... Dylan to see if she can get it, but some tell me she's gonna get it well before I do, unfortunately. I mean, fortunate for her, but unfortunate for us, because, like, she'll be able to tease me about it for quite a while until I get mine. Alright, so no to that boy. Alright, man. This, this sandwich right here just feels like a dud, anyway. Fake. We random Vaporeon for some reason. That's another thing too, like if we find like like I said earlier, like if we find say like uh how chance he could be down here, Bweasel, or anything else like that that's shiny, like I can't keep them. Like I'll have to reset because uh we're super, super low on Urban Mystica right now. Uh Dylan says good, just playing Scarlet. Very nice, man. Very, very nice. Uh same, obviously. <laughs> Uh, hoping to get that Roaring Moon today, but I, I doubt we'll be able to get it. 
Uh, he's gonna evade us for God knows how long. Uh, uh, uh. Apologies. Like I said, eventually one day we will. He might even show up with the next sandwich or uh, towards the end of this one. You never know. Uh, but I, like I said, if we don't get him today because tomorrow, you know, is our shiny Sunday, um, I might dedicate an entire day of just trying to shiny hunt him here on stream. Just because, like, he has evaded us for way, way, way too long at this point. Like, I would have done the same thing, honestly, with uh, Sandy Shocks had we not gotten him the other day. Uh, which, that felt like sweet victory as soon as we uh, got him. Uh, why can't you be a green boy? And see, like I said, it doesn't, like, typically, too, with the dual types, you can put in the other type to uh, have them spawn in as well. But down here, it won't matter, because we'll pretty much get the exact same spawns as uh, doing it as a dragon type, which is a tad bit unfortunate. And like I said, he is, uh, even with, like, the encounter rate, like, uh, we don't see him, like, every single time we come down here to check. All right. Because, like, we haven't gotten anything shiny from this, uh, run yet either, which is okay. Because we will still, like I said, we'll, uh, trade Richard here, uh, the two Pokemon that he won from the, from the quote-unquote giveaway where I just, uh, made up a while ago, and then do our second shiny sandwich, and, uh, after that, I will go get the, uh, shiny Pokemon for tomorrow, everybody. Let's see. Come on, Roaring Moon. You know you want to appear for us. Thankfully, he's an easy Pokemon to tell, too, if he's shiny. And the lighting down here shouldn't, shouldn't, in theory, uh, mess with them. Hmm. Uh, Dylan says, yeah, shiny hunting is a pain sometimes, but it pays off when you do get the shiny you've been looking for. Exactly. Exactly, man. Like, it is time, it is definitely time consuming, without a doubt, and sometimes, like, some days you can have, like, really, really good luck and get not only the shiny you were hunting, but extra ones as well. And then some days, like, uh, how we have, uh, so far today, like, you just end up with nothing. Uh, but it's definitely going to be worth it, like, uh, seeing that beautiful green dragon appear and catching him in my name. Okay, so how much time do we have left? We have 20 seconds. Ooh. Plus, I think Roaring Moon's a pretty cool Paradox Pokemon. I, I wasn't too... I'm, I'm still not too, too big on the, uh... The violet iron, or the val, uh, iron, ew, good god, I can't speak. The violet iron paradox Pokemon, not too big on them. Uh, but like I said, we will go for them eventually one day as well. Just have a full set of paradox Pokemon shiny, minus the legendaries, of course. Uh, Mitchell says, Oh my god, Danielle didn't get hit. 
Uh, I mean, she, like I said, she'll definitely get it before me. Okay, so we're gonna, that is the end of our sandwich. So we're gonna close the game and open it back up. Uh, Richard, are you still here, my man? Uh, Dylan says, for sure, I'm the same way, gotta have it in my own. Yeah, yeah. Richard says, finishing up right. All right, no worries, Richard. No worries at all. Yeah, like, I, I do like getting shiny Pokemon from other people as well. But at the same time, like, uh, I definitely, definitely like uh, finding uh, them in my own name. With that doubt, it makes it harder. Yes. Worth it? Absolutely. Danielle says, my sandwich isn't that. I know, Mitchell's just being Mitchell right now, Danielle. All right, so we're going to go and kick... Next to the internet. Ooh, my back. And my neck. Ah. That hurt. Uh, connect to the internet. Go to Poke Portal. And we're going to give Richard here uh, two shiny Pokemon. Uh, code is always the same as always, Richard. Uh, we're just waiting for him to finish up the raid for it. Oh. There are people just coming in wondering, like, wait, why is he getting a uh, Pokemon? I made a question earlier for uh, for today's session, and Richard was the first person who uh, got it correct. So I was like, all right, we'll go ahead and give him a shiny Pokemon. Uh, I'm going to check my phone, though, real quick to make sure there's no reactions that I missed. No, I think we are good. Yeah, we're good. All right, sweet. Because like I said, for some reason, OBS, uh, I'm sorry, Streamlabs earlier was unfortunately not working. And so we just kind of are winging it. Like a couple of them didn't come in, but that's okay because I did in fact save them. Uh, like I said, Daniel, you probably have way way better luck than i will have in finding him you'll probably get him first plus you've done him way more times than i have at this point so maybe maybe you will get him and we have officially been live for two and a half hours everybody okay search okay sweet search him, my man so we can get you uh two shinies Mitchell says, you make it sandwiches, I'll take one, I'm hungry. She'll probably tell you what she tells me every time I say I'm hungry. Feed yourself. Now she actually likes you. Look, <laughs> wait, wait, she actually likes you and will feed you. <laughs> Mitchell says, D everyone, Danielle's in the kitchen, what you guys want. All right, so make sure we got, we did in fact get rich. Uh, that's my personal, that's my personal. All right, so sweet. So uh, like I said, uh, we do have more, but I'll just give away two that uh, we already um, had from last Shiny Sunday. So uh, Richard, who would you like it, sir? Everybody on this page is shiny. Uh, I know it's not the most variety, uh, for it right now, but hey, they are indeed shiny boys. <laughs> Danielle says, fight me. I think, Danielle, careful what you say. You don't want to get a ban on Facebook again. And of course, I got surprised it died that fast. Weird. Uh, just waiting to see what Rich here would like. Uh, Pink Pig and Dolphin. Or, uh, Dol oh, Don Fan, Don Fan. Okay, so this one is nicknamed Kevin Bacon that came to us from, uh, of course, of course, I got air. This one uh, is named Kevin Bacon that came to us from Byron. 
Uh, so congratulations, uh, Richard. Mitchell says reported. Oh, God. I pre I'm pretty sure you meant Don Fe And Daniel says, no, not Kevin Bacon. <laughs> Danielle had her eye on Kevin Bacon for so, so long. Oh, man. Rich sent over Pulte, guys. All right, so let's give... I believe he's... I believe he meant Don Fam. Not Dolphin. <laughs> but all right, let's give this one to... Ooh, I actually don't have that version of Lycan Rock yet, so I'm going to keep that one. Uh, like I said, that's my second favorite form. My first favorite probably is the day form, honestly. I just really, really like it. Mitchell says, I'm gonna eat Kevin Bacon. And Rich says, ah, Kevin Bacon. Dude, that was so funny. It was last shiny Sunday, in fact. Uh, he told me to trade with him real quick, and I was like, okay. And he gave us, uh, Kevin Bacon. Uh, but nice, I've honestly never seen that Lycan Rock before. Or, uh, that, not before, but in this game I haven't seen him yet. <coughs> Alright, sweet. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, move these two over to... Yeah, guys, guys, get fast. Because I remember, uh, there's some spoilers. Okay. Do that. Do a save and then go from there. All right, so let's go ahead, and throw down our picnic, and get our last sandwich of the day, chat, in hopes of getting our roaring moon. Tomato, that, that, two avocado and one hamburger and two Herba Mystica. All right. I remember too why uh he sent us that one is because uh there was a huge bacon debate going on and uh I was even thinking like man bacon sounds good so Byron here sent us uh Kevin Bacon. <laughs> Let's get that avocado on there. Martin with his fingers crossed, dude. Let's hope. Let us hope. Let us hope Lord Bidoof here gives us the shiny dragon that we've been hunting forever. Alright, so let's eat our disgusting avocado sandwich. Uh, MJ says, I miss why you don't put the bread. Oh, the reason I don't put the bread on top of it, MJ, is because, like, it can knock over all of our ingredients and mess up the sandwich. The top of the bread is never needed for it. It's just to make it look pretty, pretty much. And since it's not needed, uh, uh, I just kind of go from that. And Martin says, and no, it's not this. It's the no. I see. It's bigger now. Like if you put words with the uh, emoji, like they're smaller. So I kind of had to look. I'm kind of blind, uh, even with glasses. So I have to kind of just get in their clothes. But no, I saw this time. His fingers crossed, and not, not the rude gesture. I've only flipped off. I've only done the middle finger one time here on stream, and it was to that stupid Amoongus. All right, so let's go see if we can't uh, get our dragon boy. Uh, I need to go for Raichu and Jeffrey the Giraffe one day. If we ever get a uh, giraffe rig shiny, I'll name it. It's my name, Jeff. Uh, already kind of a good start. We've got quite a few dragons, but 
not what we're looking for, unfortunately, right now. Let's see. Uh, MJ says, gotcha, okay, I'm going on a self-date Texas Roadhouse and to the movies to watch Avatar 2 and 3D. Hopefully I'll catch you tomorrow for Shiny Sunday and, mu and much love, much love, guys, and good luck. Go have yourself some fun, MJ. I hope you have a wonderful time uh, eating and also uh, going to the movies. Per like, you, like you know, personally, I'm not a fan of Avatar, but... Either way, I hope you enjoy because at the end of the day, like you said, like you were saying yesterday, MJ, opinions are like assholes. Everybody has one. <laughs> uh, but go have some fun. Yes, we will catch you tomorrow for Shiny Sunday, hopefully, MJ. Martin says, Many of you. Anytime uh, my buddy, uh, Dakota's brother, whose name is Jeff, comes in, like we always do it like that. And thankfully, he's a good sport about it. And finds it kind of funny himself. Like, uh, for, uh, one of the first days, uh, is actually, no, during one of Danielle's streams, I believe. Uh, no, it was during one of my things. I don't remember whose it was. Uh, Danielle and I were on a call, and, uh, she goes, I bet you won't, uh, do this and that. I, I was talking Mad Game, like, I had a, like, uh, send him a me voice message and saying, My name's Jeff. And, uh, Literally, uh, he sent me back almost immediately. You're an idiot. It was really funny. Uh, Martin says that's one of my commands in Queen Bee's stream. <laughs> what the, my name's Jeff. One. <laughs> oh man, she gave us another raid uh, not too long ago, which was very very kind of her. I absolutely appreciate it. MJ says, "If you're right, bye guys. We'll see you later, MJ. Go have some fun." Uh, Mart says, have an amazing, uh, day. Uh, Dylan says, every time I hear Avatar, I, I think of Avatar last year, but same. So let's, let's all forget, though, the, tr the train wreck of a live action movie that M. Night, M. Night Shyamalan made. That thing was so bad. It was terrible. And, like, uh, I, I had mentioned this before, but like when uh when I first you know first got Netflix, I saw that Avatar: the Last Airbender was on there, and I was like, okay, cool, I'll watch it, and still loved every single moment of it, loved every second of it, super super fun, and uh, then I was like, I tried finishing Legend of Korra because like I never finished it uh when it first came out, so I was like, okay, I'll finish it, and I did, and it just wasn't great to me, especially in comparison to The Last Airbender. It didn't have that emotional toll or great characters that um, The Last Airbender did. Uh, Martin says, I'm one of her mom. Okay, okay, sweet, bro, sweet. I did not know that. I know, I remember uh, you and a few others uh, came over from uh, her page and just hang out here as well, and I'm highly appreciative and grateful for it. I remember too, like uh, first raid she ever did uh, for us. Like, I had no idea how to uh, pronounce like her uh, page name, and like, luckily she was like, "This is how it's pronounced." I'm like, "Okay, cool," because again, I'm bad with names, but it was highly, highly great. I was highly grateful and appreciative for it for both for both of them, without a doubt. Like I said, the way I have my stuff set up, I unfortunately cannot do raids. And they keep changing, like, so much stuff over on Facebook, like, doing raids. Uh, which, again, I'm still kind of new to all this uh, for doing it on my own. It's uh, It can be a little bit troublesome at times, unfortunately. Ah. Uh. But one day we'll be able to return the kindness that other streamers themselves have done to, for us. Ah, oh, man. None of these boys. 
Uh, Marn says, haha, she's a good egg. Oh, yeah. Without a doubt, my man. Like I said, streamers helping streamers out is definitely, definitely a big, big plus here in the community. Because at the end of the day, majority of us are just here to play video games, hang out, and just entertain you guys as best as we can. Uh, Martin says, bro, you're doing an awesome job, so don't worry about it. Much love to you, Martin. Much, much love to you. Like I said, doing this every single day, like, and I'm honest with you guys about it. Some days it has its tolls where I'm just like, uh, you know, just one of those, eh, uh, moods like I was, like, a couple days ago. But I still did it, and still ended up having a very, very good time doing it. It's just... You know, coming up with new material to stay funny and also to uh, the way the algorithm works for Facebook and everything like that. It's just, uh, it gets a little tough. Oh! Get down here. Get down here, chat. He finally appeared. Quick ball. Please, for the love of God, get in. Oh my god, that was our last one. Oh. Finally. Roaring Moon Shiny has finally appeared, chat. Uh, Tito, Dylan says yes. Tito says GG's. Simon says well done, GG's. Daniel said I got- Wait, did you get him too? Wait, there's no way we caught him at the same time. Oh, the hunt is finally... I'm almost tempted to Master Ball him. I am almost tempted to Master Ball him. MJ says, yay, I didn't miss it. You didn't. You saw the glory. The power of you guys believing in me. We finally got... If he gets in the ball... <laughs> We finally got our final, final Paradox Pokemon for this game. Besides Slytherwing, we still gotta go hunt for him, but that is okay. That does not matter at this point. Because we got the one I've been wanting since I started this journey. Uh, that's not gonna work, boy. We got a message from Danielle, so let me see. Because she said she caught him. She found him as well. No! Thank God, I backed out that time. Oh, she did. She found him. She also got Roaring Moon. Oh, goodness. All right. Roaring Moon. Please get in the ball. Martin also says, let's fucking go. Simon says, do it. I'm thinking about it because I don't want him to disappear. Uh, I'm going to keep throwing repeat balls for a little bit, though. Oh, goodness. That's a great catch. He should be done. We got him. We got him, chat. Oh. Oh, it feels like forever. No. No nickname. We did it. Tito says Master Belt. Thankfully, we didn't have to. Daniel says, four minutes into a second sandwich, I Master Belt. Yeah, I don't blame. I was also thinking about Master Balling mine. Because I was not sure if he had a move that could kill himself. Uh, Tito says GG's. Simon says GG's. And Dylan also says GG's. Thank you, guys. I'm throwing a save. I, I don't care if we get anything else shiny right now. Like, definitely, definitely saving it. Oh my goodness, and Martin with the clip as well. Thank you, Martin. I have no idea what I was talking about right before it. Uh maybe number two. Yeah, if we get two, if we get two in a row, uh, I'll make an OnlyFans account. I will make an OnlyFans account chat. Uh Martin says G freaking G, dude. Thank you, Martin. Oh my god. No more sacrificing Pokemon down here for the cause. We finally got him. Uh, we've been stuck on... Danielle also caught him, so 
congratulations to her as well. It's kind of funny. We both find ours at the exact same time. Oh, my goodness. I'm so happy right now. Ah, oh, we are officially done. With them, we can move on to other po meaning now, guys. During the week, we can officially start trying to finish the Violet decks, getting some Urban Mystica, and going for those shiny Pokemon. Oh my God! So I'm definitely gonna see if I can get some help from uh from some friends for that, so we could do this fast, so we could do that fast in order to uh not only get Urban Mystica. But to uh, start shiny hunting those paradox Pokemon as well, Danielle's funny. We got it at the same time. That is that is so weird. As soon as you uh, as soon as you said that, I was like, "There's no way we both got it at the same time." That is incredible timing, though. Oh my god. Uh, Simon says congratulations, and uh, Martin also says GG's, Danielle. Uh, much love to both of you. Oh, man. Dylan says, that's crazy. You both got them in a few seconds. Of each other. Dude, that is. That that sounds almost like the kind of story you would tell somebody and they wouldn't be like, aha, sure you did. But no, she she sent me a picture of him like uh, right after she caught him and did the Martin says, so is this up for grabs? Oh, you fuck right off. That is mine. <laughs> That is my roaring moon, my man. Uh, we will have, we will possibly have something to give away though. But no, that's my first one, and that one is sticking with me, chat. Oh God. Ah, oh, feel like an achievement or a trophy should have popped up on screen right there. Ah, uh, for that catch. Oh. Be nice if we did get a second one, but even if we don't, like, I'm just, I'm letting the sandwich run out at this point, because we still have half time for it. So to see if we can get a uh, Zwellius, Gibble, or another Roaring Moon shiny. Oh, God. That is so great. I, I, ne I needed that pick-me-up right there. Uh, so even though we have not officially caught Slitherwing, in our name yet. Uh we we will do that. We will do that. Martin says, Wow, it's like that. <laughs> you knew the answer, Martin, as soon as you asked it. You knew the answer, bro. Uh <laughs> like, no, that is mine. <laughs> um, Dylan says, Good way to uh to end stream all no, absolutely. Absolutely. That that was the highlight of today's session. Was getting that roaring move. I, I here's the thing, I don't even remember what the hell we were talking about right there. Uh but that was that's definitely the big huge highlight. So our, I would say our biggest highlights this week were uh the Sandy Shocks and this guy. <laughs> Simon says L O L Martin. <laughs> Martin says, yeah, I did. So, yeah, Martin Martin knew. He just wanted to hear me yell at him. <laughs> oh, my God. That is sweet victory, chat. Oh, goodness. I want to see what his stat... I want to see what his stat... I don't even care about his stats, but I want to see, like, if we could, uh... Possibly make him into a raid, uh, Pokemon for later on purposes, because that would be fantastic. Uh, but yeah, Martin, you definitely, you knew better, Martin. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Daniel says, I'm already in a Discord call with Mitchell whenever you're, you're ready to trade for its shiny Sunday. All right, uh, like I said, uh, this is our last sandwich, uh, Danielle, and then after, I will end today's session and then hop on the call with you two. But yeah, that is definitely sweet victory right there, chat. Uh.
Uh, like, I don't even care if anything else pops up at this point. Like, we got the big prize. Uh, and to think, now I don't have to dedicate an entire day to uh, shiny hunting him, so now I gotta figure out, too, uh, what do we do from here? <laughs> like I said, though, I definitely want to uh, get things ready to go out and start playing Violet again to go shiny hunt those Paradox Pokemon. Uh, I'm not sure how long it'll take, because uh, this one... I would say this one took us about maybe a week and a half to get all the Paradox Pokemon shiny. Uh, so, which, there's the, there's the same number. The ones that are going to be the hardest to get in that one is going to be uh, both Iron Thorns as well as Iron Valley. Because it's the same equivalent to both Sandy Shocks and um, to Roaring Moon. But I'm just glad those two are finished finally. Uh, Martin says, it's definitely a big GG's to you, bro. Dude, it was a huge victory that we needed. Without a doubt. We have sacrificed so many Pokemon down here in order to get him, and those sacrifices were definitely well worth it. And then I'd sing the shiny song, either. Hey, what's up, Angel? How are you doing today, dude? Uh, Angel, you missed it. We finally got Roaring Moon Shiny. Uh, it was it was a great, great, great victory. Uh, I'm trying to think what with this timer we have to. I know what we could go. Okay, so we already have everything down here that's a dragon type, correct? So, we still have our sandwich up, so let me find the town. Uh, if I can find it, that is. There we go. We're going to go in this cave and see if we can't get a uh, shiny shell gone, because why not? I think we have shell gone in this one. Should be shell gone in Dino, if I remember correctly. Either way, we're going to go check out this cave, because we already have everything shiny down there that we wanted. So, let's see if our luck will... Uh, pass on to this cave. Alright, so we're gonna run down here and see if we can't get something. Because this is a dragon cave. Alright, so if we get Dino, then we officially have the entire Hydreigon line finish, and getting a Shelgon would be an incredible victory as well. But I don't remember if Shelgon is in this one. If it was this game or if it was Violet, it was probably Violet. So it's probably going to be uh, Dino down here, which is fine. Gives us something different to chase for a second. Okay, yeah, it was definitely Violet. I, I could not for the life of me remember. Uh, Dylan says, yeah, it's it should be Violet. Okay, okay. Because like, we did one one day uh, during session. Uh, on Violet, and I didn't have Area Zero unlocked uh, yet, so I was down here and saw Shell gone, so that's why I thought of them. Okay, so, yeah, we'll just keep going back and forth, see if we can't get uh, Dino uh, to spawn in Shiny for us. Martin says, right, bro, I've got to get my son to bed, so I'll see you tomorrow. All right, bro. Martin, thank you so much for hanging out with us, and we will catch you tomorrow for Shiny Sunday. Uh, MJ says, I was supposed to leave, uh, but right, uh, after, uh, oh, I accidentally ran into him. I was supposed to leave, but after RM, uh, Roaring Moon, I had to say, uh, you're good. You're good, MJ. I appreciate you staying, but, uh, go have yourself a wonderful day. We don't have too much longer for, uh, today's session. Like, we literally have 10 minutes left for today's session. And also, uh, MJ, if you're going to uh, Texas Roadhouse, which I've never been to, can you pick me up some of those rolls? I've never had any of those rolls. I've actually never eaten there, but I heard everybody talks about their rolls being really, really good. Uh, if we can get our shiny, if we can get him shiny, then we have the entire line done. If not, I could transfer one from uh, Pokemon Go once... Uh, 
that's compatible with the game. So that way I can have the entire line for him done. You're not shiny, are you? I don't remember what you look like. Okay, no. How do you use the Mystica? Uh, so when you make the sandwich, MJ, uh, you want to make it so your base ingredients are always going to be the same, which is one tomato, uh, green pepper, onion, and a hamburger, and then two of whatever t so for example if you want to go for dragon you want to use uh two avocado then select like two herba mystica you can mix and match them it doesn't matter and then just kind of go from there like it always has to be in the picnic session for it obviously but uh in fact in our discord if i'm not mistaken we do have the picture up there for uh anybody who's looking to uh do shiny sandwiches uh, Dylan says, I need to get Noibat and Skrelch shiny. I don't have either of them shiny in any game, I don't think. They would... I remember Noibat's a really, really cool shiny. I don't remember what Skrelch looks like shiny. Alright, uh, so no to any of them. They look a lot brighter down here, Gibble, than, uh... Uh than they do in the cave, uh, other cave. Uh, MJ says, so only two, I so only two, I I only have one. Yeah, you have to use two as the minimum, uh, MJ, for it, uh, for the shiny sandwich. Uh, MJ says, I got my Noi about a day ago. Very nice, MJ. Very, very nice. Like I said, I don't have him yet in anything. But I remember uh, Noi Bat and Noi Burn were really, really cool shinies. I have seen them before. All right, so for okay, I, I'm kind of having to look a little bit harder on the gibbles uh, down here because they're a lot lighter down here than they were in Area Zero Cave, which is kind of weird to me. But either way, if we don't get anything else, I'm fine with that because we got the big prize. Uh, so many Pokemon were sacrificed <laughs> for him, but it was definitely worth it to me. Uh, in fact, like, for, uh, the run of him, we sacrificed two Gibble and three, uh, Zoelius for, uh, to save our Urban Mystica for him, and it's definitely worth it to me. Kind of like with Sh Sandy Shocks, we had to sacrifice a uh, Pommy, but it in turn made up for it, because not only did we get Sandy Shocks, but we also ended up getting our uh, our uh, Pommy back as well. And we have officially been live for three hours, everybody. I don't remember what he looks like, Shiny. Alright, so we kind of had to play Show Me Your Belly game with them down here. Because, like I said, they're lighter color down here, which I find kind of weird. But either way, it is all good. I did not even see you when I was running. Uh, I don't remember what Pokemon. I think it's... Uh, Diglett and Doug Trio, like every time I accidentally run into them, I have to unfortunately kill them because they have, uh, they can have the ability area trap, which makes it so, like, you can't run away in normal battle. How much time do we have left for this one? We have five minutes. Something tells me, uh, we're probably not going to get anything else from the sandwich, but that is okay. So we got that lone little Dino right there, and then we continue our way. Plus, like, I already have, uh, like I said, I thought it was, uh, the Salamence line for this game, which I was wrong. My bad for that. Uh, but luckily I already have the Salamence line, uh, a full team of them shiny in, uh, Pokemon, uh, 
uh, Sword and Shield with the DLC. Like, I was able to get them all shiny, so that made that makes it a little bit easier. Because I always try to go for um, different <coughs> different Pokemon each game. So, like, for example, if I don't have um, the Pokemon shiny, I always, always, always uh, try to go hunt for uh, something else. Angel says it's pronounced it coming from the person who says Arceus. I don't want to hear it from you. It's Arceus. All right. Uh, no to any of these boys. Okay, no, that Garchomp. I had to look at that Garchomp for or not Garchomp goodbye. If that was Garchomp, then definitely I would add a magnifying glass right there. Alright, so last time I looked, we had like five minutes left. Okay, yeah, so it takes us about, looks like about a minute and a half to do a full run down here in this cave. Uh, no to any of them, no to them, right? Yeah. Well, their blue would have changed color, too, on Gibble. All right. Mm. Which we've gotten Gibble. We've already gotten Gibble quite a few times already. Thankfully, it's just like I said. If we get him, then we have the entire Hydrogen line finished. Which even if we don't, I'm fine with it. Because they're all the same color shiny. There's no like major differences between any of them. Which I want to say we have two Gibble left. Two or three. I really don't remember. Uh, dude, it's, it's base of German count of one, two, three... Dinozoelius Hydrogum. I don't care. Just like the birds named after Uno Dos Trace. Uh, how much time? Minute 40. So probably by the time we get back down to the other end of the cave, we will be done. Mm. Mm. God. I don't remember what that one looks like, Shiny. No to those guys. Remember too when I came down here uh, on Violet, I didn't have the. I unfortunately didn't have the shiny charm either, but I didn't wait. I it wasn't me that used the um, Urban Mystica for it. I don't even remember who it was I was playing with that day, but we were all we all did Dragon. I believe I know Danielle was in there. I believe she was still going for Roaring Moon at the time. Which now I gotta think who we're gonna use our urban. Well, we still need Slitherwing. Shiny in our name. Mm. Okay, so yeah, that was the end of it. Let me check. Alright, sweet. So let me go ahead and. Uh, go to Zipsap Town, wherever that is. Zipsap Paddywhack. 
Nope. Uh... God, I'm still not a fan of the map on this one. Okay, there it is. Alright. So that was our official last sandwich of today. And now, guys, I am going to go ahead and end the stream here in just a second, after I save it again, to uh, get them done. All right, there we go. All right, so controller's down for a minute. So yeah, like I said, I'm going to end today's session here, and then I'm going to go get the rest of the shiny Pokemon for tomorrow's session. And uh, yeah, just kind of go from there. So uh, Dylan says, uh, good stream, have a good day. All right, man, we'll catch you tomorrow. But all right, guys, once again, Thank you guys so much for your likes, your shares, your stars, and your follows. It is highly appreciated. And until tomorrow, guys, always remember, stay awesome and stay positive. Bye, everybody.